Welcome. Did I turn my mic on? Yes. Yes. Yes, I did. Hello. Be cool would be a good Twitch emote. I wish I had more animated slots. Happy Tuesday. I just had a giant plate of viscous and gravy that I made. And it was really good. And now I'm ready to go to bed. So this is a going to bed stream now. Good night. <laughs> um, hi, we're gonna play more Elden Ring. Um, not the, not the highest highest viewer engagement stream that exists, unfortunately. <laughs> uh, but you know what? This is what I want to play, so. That's the way it's going to be. Um, let me toss out some thank yous real quick. Thank you, Super Mario 64 PSP with the sub. Uh, thank you to Melodic Reverb for the sub. Thank you, Sphinxacore for the sub. Thank you to Belbino for the sub. The Kiplo, thank you for the sub. And that's all. Thank you. Yeah, I think the, the main quote unquote problem with streaming Elden Rings right now is um, that everyone wants to play it themselves, <laughs> which is fully understandable. There's not really, a, not quite as much of a market for, for viewing this one if it's a game you have much interest in playing yourself. So I get it. It's fine. <sighs> okay. All right. Let's, um... Let's get to... Let's put... Let's put gaming on this screen. God, I'm sleepy. I'm sorry. Okay. All right. Shut, shut that up. Um, turn this on. Has a volume feel. I don't... I keep changing the volume in between streams due to playing it myself and wanting to hear it. It's probably fine. Okay. Swa, uh, swoosh. This has just been kind of doing this um, after I alt-tabbed. It's been nice for me to watch. All right. Let's... Um, Turn on my controller. Thank you. Alright. Turn on the controller. Turn on the controller. Turn. Turn. Turn! Okay. There we go. Alright, we're here. Uh, this is what Coriander looks like now. <laughs> Things have changed a little bit. I am now dual wielding whips. <laughs> Uh, because I learned after last stream that there's power stancing in this game. It doesn't mention it anywhere, but there is. It's the beloved, beloved uh, feature from Dark Souls 2. And it's great. It's not as strong as my fucking Bloodhound Fang Sword, which I still have to use a lot of the time. Look, even this person's using it. Um, I still have to use the Bloodhound Fang as a crutch for bosses a lot of the time. But... Uh, but yeah, yeah. You can power stance anything into the same category. You can, you can fucking, you can just got got two colossal great swords. Still good. Use your power to stance them. I'm really slow though because I can't hold. This is like <laughs> this is like 41 weight of weapon. I do think that a build that uses this would be extremely fun. I can't roll. Oh yeah, power, uh, so, okay, yeah, I'll explain to you uh, what power stancing is. So there's a few ways to equip weapons. Um, 
If you have a weapon in your right hand and you hit R1, you do one-handed attacks. If you hold a weapon in your right hand and do R2, you do heavy attacks. If you hold top face button and then hit R1, you will two-hand your weapon, which increases the power, puts away your left hand thing. Um, and you can also do R1 and R2 attacks with it, which is uh, cool. Um, however, if you have two weapons in the same category, so in this game it's a little bit easier to tell because they'll be on like the same column generally, unless you have stuff that overflows to the next column, which is possible. Um, if you hit L1 when you have two weapons of the same category equipped, you will do a power stance attack, which attacks with both weapons. Oh, there's lines between them? That's nice. Oh yeah, I guess there would be. I guess, yeah, that, that line divider is... Yeah, yeah, yeah. So there's no divider between these because they're all like medium shields. Okay, yeah, that's cool. Um, but yeah, if you hit L1, you'll do power stance moves. Um, and there is typically, like there's a combo. There is a backstep attack. There's a rolling attack. It gets like a full suite of moves. There's a jumping attack. Uh, and I don't really know how the damage is calculated with these things. Um, I think damage-wise, it's like, I mean, I guess it depends on what level your weapons are at, too. But, like, for instance, if I slap this Jerboa, come here, with the jumping attack, come here, <laughs> I'll get you. So that did 213, did 406 to that one, so I don't, I don't fucking know anything. Um, regular, uh, let's do, a, like, a, a two-handed jumping attack on this one. Oops. Come back. Oh, I'm gonna get you. I love the idea of, like, two-handing a whip, by the way. It's really funny. Okay, well, that did 429. I don't know anything. That was also a standing move. We'll test on, like, an actual guy. Anyway, it's cool. Um, the uh, main benefit is if you have like a heavy weapon or a weapon that inflicts, inflicts status effects, you will accrue stun and or status effects much more quickly because you're hitting twice. Um, although I'm not sure if that's true of moves that... So like some, some of these have two hitboxes. Like this, that's two hitboxes. But then um, this, I think is one hitbox. So I think probably you don't get like double, double stat effect building on this, but I'm not sure. I've not done the math. I don't have the science. Um, my weapons that I'm using right now are regular whips that have been imbued with flame art. Oh yeah, it breaks guards faster. That's right. <coughs> flame art is, um, I found a, a wet blade that lets me put flame art and fire enchant on any weapon. Um, and flame art is uh, faith scaling. So I finally have like some okay faith scaling. Um, so these, these are, uh, it's, it's, I think it's not quite as strong as if I was just doing straight, uh, strength decks on there, but guess what I don't have, uh, that much of? It's strength decks. I have more than I should, but, uh, not enough to get a whole lot out of the full physical ones. Also, it's nice because, uh, these whips will hit armored guys for, like, actual damage. So I think two, what two-handing does is it, uh, I'm not positive, but I know that like if you don't have enough strength or dex to wield something, you can two-hand it and it will like multiply your strength or dex by, uh, I don't remember, your, your effective strength or dex by like 1.5 or something like that. So like, for instance, there's weapons that I have right now that I cannot one-hand, but I can two-hand. Does it actually show up here, I wonder? Because I have it's showing twenty one. No, that's that's normal. Anyway, it's it's. I think it might be an invisible bonus, but um, oh, Dex doesn't get multiplied. Okay, so Strength does. Only multiply Strength. Okay, that sounds right then. For some reason, I was just assuming it did it for any requirement stat, but it makes the most sense that it would only do Strength. You're just using both of your, your physical arms. Doesn't make them more dexterous. In fact, probably makes them less dexterous. 
So yeah, I guess uh, for, for dex weapons, especially then, and for builds that don't use a lot of strength, then uh, power stancing becomes more effective than two-handing something. So yeah, that actually, that makes a lot of sense then. So yeah, power stancing is basically like two-handing for, for dex and other stats. So that that kind of, that's nice, that balances that out. I hadn't really thought about the, the reasoning and how it effectively shakes out. But yeah, that's cool. Uh, anyway, I haven't really been thinking about that. I mostly, I have a lot of faith right now because I don't know what else to put stat points into. Um, I know, I know there is respecking in this game, so I'm not, I'm trying not to worry too much about it, about my decisions. Uh, this whip is upgraded to hell as well. It's 14. Um, and I'm just kind of running around the world. Uh, here's the state of my world. I'm going to zoom out now. Um, I've been all over Kaled. Uh, I have not beaten the boss here. I have seen the boss. I do not know how I'm going to beat the boss. Um, I will show you this today because it's an extremely cool setup. Um, uh, I wandered around a lot. I found like some stuff. Um, if you're curious, the boss arena for this for this area for this part of the world for like the the Lord boss or whatever. This is the boss arena. <laughs> I smear and bite and yell and stay if I can't get my help in free. <laughs> <laughs> Say these words every day to increase your power. Anyway, this is the boss arena. All this. So, just think about what that could mean. Um, yeah, there's a bunch of stuff I haven't done over here. Um, I've done... I think most of what I can do here, but also I saw something mentioned uh, when I was looking up a little bit of uh, news today, because my phone feeds me gaming news. Um, it just It's like, hey, here's some articles that we think you would really love, and it, it just mentioned something bald-faced from... Is so yellow. Yeah. <laughs> it's true. Uh, it, one of the news articles was just like, here's this! This is an Elden Ring, did you know? And I was like, okay, well now I do. Um, so there's something here in this area. I don't know where exactly that I have not found. Um, I did most of Australia here. Um, I have not been to Hogwarts yet, but I know it's here. Uh, there's also, I think, probably a lot more landmass off to the left. I really love the way that this game uh, constricts the map around only places that you've been. Um, at least until you find the, like, southmost and eastmost and probably westmost things. Because, like, once I, once I walked here and got this map, like, all this shit opened up. So I know now that uh, this is the full size of the right side of the map. But it's really cool how you don't get an idea of how big the actual map was. Um, I learned some stuff. Some of it was from inference, and some of it was from being told. Uh, for instance, is there actually, is there a way to turn off uh, markers? Probably not, actually. Anyway, you see how there's like an orange something here behind all these little UI bits? Um, I learned that if you see an orange looking cave on the map, that is a marker for a smithing material mine. Um, there's actually like a lot of stuff that's marked on the map for you to like notice when you get into an area. And that's what that one is. Um, I still don't know what this one is. Does anyone know what these are? It looks like a telescope or maybe like a oil machine for extracting. What are, what are these? A bird's eye telescope. Okay. I don't think I have seen that. Maybe I'll go inspect that. Um, but yeah, there's like a lot of little, there's a lot of things. Like the tree, tree is kind of obvious. It means there's a tree there. I like how you get a double tree <laughs> when you go to the actual tree. Um, there's the orange caves for smithing, smithing material mines. Uh, there is, of course, the um, the weird circles for Everjails. Like, uh, I think this is one, maybe. That might be a building, actually. I don't know. And then, like, churches and stuff like that also have, like, a, a fairly standardized shape on the map. I, f I found this. <laughs> I, think, I think probably if a lot of you follow Wayne, you might have seen him also find this. 
Um, yeah, this area where I originally got warped so early in the game and it seemed so scary is actually just fully normal to me now. Um, but yeah, I uh, I got my, my flask of wondrous physic, which is great. I guess I drank it, so there's none left. Um, and yeah, I, uh, so what I was doing last time was there's this this thing on the map. Uh, I thought it was going to be an Everjail because it's like a circular thing, but it's uh, it's actually a Ainsel River Well. So, oh god. Uh, so I'm gonna go in here, I guess. I didn't go in. Ugh! I keep trying to scroll in my chat, and it scrolls the camera in the game. Okay. All right. Oh, wrong. Yep. Right. Okay. So let's go in here. I never been down one of these. Oh, it's magic elevator. I guess we are in Hogwarts City. Uh, my physic flask, I think, has like a uh, bonus faith and uh, one hit damage absorption shield, which has been very helpful to me. Oh yeah, um, I got some more uh, some more miracles as well, which I'll show you some of. Um, let me. I'll just chug here, because there's a faith. I got Dragonfire, which kind of sucks, because I don't have very much Arcane, but I did want to put in enough Arcane to see it. My Dragon Flame is not especially strong, and also it takes so much fucking FP. There's no universe in which that's worth using. Um, I got Lightning Spear, which I was really happy about, because I love Lightning Spear in Souls. It's so cute spell, um, and it's really good here. Because you can do it really quick. Check this out. It also aims better in this game <laughs> than in Souls. Uh, you can also charge it up, so you can do like a quick one. Or you can do a mighty one. And it's really strong. I kind of replaced the uh, the dark fireball that I was using before with lightning spear. Because it's like more accurate. Uh, does a little bit more damage base. Um, and yeah, it's just good. And then I have uh, Flame Grant Me Strength, which I did not actually sit down, so I don't have any FP. Um, but yeah, this is good. Uh, it grants you physical and fire attack, or enhances your affinities with that, or something like that. Uh, but basically, like my status, um, let's see, right armament one, three, four, eight power. If I chop this, oh wait, that's, well, that three, four, eight was my, uh, my, um, Talisman thingy, but now it's up to 418. 34810. Okay, yeah. Maybe it's not my talisman. Maybe it's not counting. Oh wait, yeah, it's it's armament one, so it's not my talisman. So yeah, it's it's a pretty big buff. Uh, but yeah, it's uh, this is just free. It only lasts for 30 seconds though. Um, but the nice thing is that it does not require you. It it just applies to you, your body. Um, so it uh, for one. It will work on a weapon that already has like an element infusion. Something I learned is that a uh, lightning weapon and stuff like that will not work if your weapon already has an element on it, which made me very sad. But also, it uh, since it just goes on you, you don't have to like cast using your left hand in order to enchant your right hand. Uh, so that's nice. Anyway, let's look around in here. Yeah, I I. I don't think I ever used the enchant spells in Dark Souls, because I don't remember if Faith got one. Be wary of range battle. Thank you, Sand, for Message of Water, which I am about to drink the last sip of. Help. Oh, also, thank you, Taxi, for the sub. I think I missed that somehow. All right, um, these I think are, they look like a bug. Canatine has appeared to save me from a dry, dry mouth. All right, well, I'm gonna slap this with lightning. Okay, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. God, okay, that that's still a problem, but that's okay. Dark Fireball would not have hit from this distance either. There we go. They're big ants! Thank you for 
the water. They're big fuzzy ants. They're DreamWorks ants. <laughs> A bug's death. <laughs> I'll go... Hmm, which way first? This looks like a waterfall, so I'll peek over here. What does this say? Dead end ahead? Awesome. Perfect. That's what I want, actually. Be wary of ahead, bug ahead. First off, up. Oh, I see. It just died up there. Be wary of behind. I missed that one. <laughs> okay, now I see it. <laughs> Magic grease. Mmm. It's like the biscuits and gravy I made. What's what next to my health bars? Oh yeah, by the way, I don't have um, any... Whips are like... Ex oh, the icon to the left? Oh, that's my great rune. I'll tell you about that in a sec. Um, I don't have any, let me restart what I'm saying. Okay. For, as, for Ashes of War, there are not a lot that are compatible with whips because so many Ashes of War are like, oh, you do a cool slash with your sword or like, oh, you stab yourself with your sword or stuff like that. And it's like, well, you can't really, <laughs> it's a rope. So there are a lot of Ashes of War that don't work with it. So the only Ash of War I have that's like worth a shit, um, that I can use is this. Is a Yoshi stomp. That's not what Yoshi stomp sounds like. Um, so that's my cool move that I have. I wish I had other ones. Uh, the Great Rune. Okay, so you remember that when I beat uh, Roderick. Hang on, I have to go. Well, I don't want to go to a, um, a fucking a sit down for this. <laughs> Uh, I beat Roderick and I got a great rune, but it was like deactivated. Well, I activated it. Uh, and once active, it you can equip it. Um, and it does absolutely nothing. Which is good. However, if you have what is called a rune arc, um, you will gain your great rune's power. Which I will do now and I'll show you what its power is. Take a look at my stats. 17, 14, 16, 21, 21, 7, 37, 12. So you can just remember it by singing that that song. Let's chomp this rune arc. It gives us every status effect for a little bit. Only a little bit. It's fine. It's safe. And then, um... Now my stats are all... They have five more. Did I call him Roderick? It's Godric. Sorry. Um... So this gives you, uh, like, I think baseline, it gives you a little bit of HP, as uh, like the rune arc does. And then the effect of this great rune gives me five and everything, which is kind of a huge buff. Kind of huge. Very nice. So <coughs> it's just great. So this is basically the equivalent of humanity uh, in the Souls games. Yeah, it's 40 levels. So when you put it that way, it's insane. Uh, so this lasts until you die. So in that way, it is like humanity. It gives you a little boost. Uh, it's nice. You get them uh, every time that you beat a boss in co-op. So I was farming godly for a little while. Farming godly. I was farming Godric for a little while uh, to get a bunch of rune arcs, which I've since spent. And um, you can also find them from rats, apparently. People say that you can find them from rats, but I have not found a single one from a rat. So I'm wondering if that's maybe like network test network test knowledge and it has since changed. I don't know. But I've not found a single rune arc from a rat and I have farmed a lot of rats. Oh, you got one? Okay, well, I have really bad luck then, I guess. Grace Mimic, okay. Maybe everyone who's farming them is uh, doing it with an arcane build. <laughs> oh yeah, put this shit on. Oh yeah, I will also use this for no reason. Oh. Look up at the sky. Try piercing. 
Oh, you get them from victory as an invader? That's cool. I have not uh, done an invasion yet, although I want to. I haven't found the item, the reusable one for it. Bad time to take my hand off my controller. Yeah, I'm on PC. <coughs> this one? Dead end ahead? Perfect. Behind. Is that a living one? It is. So, the thing that you can sell to the Finger Lady is not the Great Rune. The Great Rune is separate from, uh... Oh, wait, this is crafting. What you're thinking of is this thing, Remembrance of the Grafted. Um, I, I assume that you can maybe chomp this if you want and then just get a bunch of runes, but then you can also use it to get a weapon if you want. Yeah, you get the Great Rune and the Remembrance. Ah, stinky. Okay, you can chomp it. Thank you, Gabu Barks, for the sub. Beware of monstrosity. <coughs> worth 20k? That's not worth chomping. I think the ant's blast just hurts me and maybe puts a stink on me. I wasn't really paying attention. No, I would have noticed it if it put a stink on me. I love these whips. Silver Firefly. Ugh. Oh, what are these? What are these from? What are these of? Smithing Stone. I hadn't even really thought about the fact that durability is not in this, but yeah, it totally isn't. This will go up. Hop, hop. Time for fear. I want to go home. Oh, I want to go home. Therefore, I want to go home. Oh, I want to go home. Okay, I don't want to go in there yet. Yeah, I have flame art on the whips, which makes them fire and also scale with faith. I'll go here first. Well, maybe this is progress. Shid, I don't know anything. Oh, I can always go back. My quote-unquote build has extremely just been, like, I find stuff that I want to use and I put in the stats to use it. Knowing that there is a respec eventually has emboldened me. <laughs> right now it's time for experimentation. I think um, if I played another character in this, I might build around uh, just attempting to dual wield uh, great clubs or whatever that category is called. Because that seems cool. I want so much stagger. Gorgeous view. Okay, that's an elevator. There's a face. How'd you put that up there? How'd you... That's a summon sign, even. <laughs> how'd you... How'd you put this here? Well, I guess it's put here by the... Is this the summon pool? It's very funny that it gets stuck up there. 
This is progress, by the way. Okay. Let's, I guess, go go back to the place where they wanted to go home from. I do also constantly feel underpowered for bosses, by the way. <laughs> when not using the Bloodhound thing. Which is God's weapon. But it's okay. Because this game has mechanics that help you deal with that. Okay. Alright. Can I slap these? No. Oh! It's queen. Only one thing to do. Oh wait, can I? Okay, I can target that, so it is foe. Golden Gram. Whoa. Oh. oh, I want to go home. Gulp, gulp, gulp. <laughs> He's spraying. Resigned. All right. I want those. Yeah. Oh yeah. I guess there was a rump here. I wonder if you can actually just walk through that room, maybe. Where did I get lightning strike? Uh, like you mean lightning spear? There's um on the map. There it. Wow, it's dark out here. What? Um, why is my map dark? <laughs> Never noticed that before. Uh, there's a guy wandering around on the overworld, like um, click right stick. Oh. I see. I did not know this existed. Um, it's a guy wandering around over here, south of Artist's Shack, if you have that. And he he has a book of uh, lightning stuff on him. At least I think that's where I got this. I love seeing people using the fucking dog shit Game of Thrones sword. Visions of hole. Okay, so up there is different from down here. Does Spinner from My Hero Academia have a sword, sword power? I literally don't remember anything about that guy except looks like a Ninja Turtle. I assume that was his power. Oh, he made a big sword. Okay. His power is he loves being a turtle. What is that rolling guy? What are these? I don't know that I've met these. These are like weird kappa. They're all... I've got their attention. Can I breathe dragon on them? Let's go down. Not very good. <laughs> so many guys! I imagine that the dragon stuff is uh, probably really good if you are built around it. And 
absolutely no other it's, uh, context. The other kind of build that I think I would want to do is a bleed-based one with Power Stance. I think that would be really fun. All right, well, um, I guess I'll, hang on, let me put this on just in case. In we go. Awesome. These guys are, <laughs> they do not get stunned. Okay, getting the old charged whip, ow. That's so many guys? What are they doing? Uh oh. Are they gonna... Ah! Ebola's. guys cut that out. Uh oh. I love the uh, the whip charge attack for large groups. Okay. Oh, one remains. I'm also currently using um, the thing that enhances jump attacks, which is why I'm jump attacking so much. Because the whip's jump attack is really good. Specifically the power stance one. Jones? Full name? It's really good that uh, power stance jump attacks are strong because, of course, you're going to want to do them. I've still yet to find a uh, illusory wall, by the way. Only wary of liar. I wrote ahead. Strong foe, therefore look carefully. That's... I think that's just a normal guy over there. Oh! <laughs> what is that? What is that? Where's my, where's my looking toy? Did notice me from this? Uh oh. Yeah! <laughs> okay, well. Yeah, I really did use Power Gem, huh? The Power Gem! Dun dun dun. Dun 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 dun. Bum bum bum. Ba bum 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 bum. Oi. Enjoy Warrior's meal. Enjoy Wario's meal. Ow. Hey, it pulls me back? Yeah, one thing I've really been enjoying from Flame Art is the fact that I can do full damage to armored foes. 
tough guys. Oh, that was the um, the underground music from Link's Awakening. And I think it also appears in Oracle of so-and-so. Is that guy casting spell? Ow! My noggin. I got polite bow, by the way, which is best in slot emote. All right, let's go. Is that? I guess it's a bug. Is this like a safety message? Time for range battle. It's like, it definitely, it has arms. Is it like a guy hanging upside down with like, oh man, I don't know. It was kind of a GLaDOS situation. High spot major head up there. Why is he pointing this way? Oh, maybe it's fine. Uh oh. Can I hit from here? Nope. From here. Nope. What about from here? Yep. Is this gonna hide me? <laughs> Alright, no problem. Wait, I'm gonna slip off. I have another stupid strat. It's a good crosshair. Missed. The nice thing about the hand ballista is that um, 
since it doesn't scale with anything, as crossbows are wont to do. Um, you don't have to worry about, like, your stats. It's just like, if you could wield it, then it's a useful thing to have. There we go. All done. Blow it up. Who knows what I got for that? It's like maybe a few thousand souls. Yeah, I do need to upgrade it at some point. I actually kind of like, um, I like Great Bows a little more, just flavor-wise. And it does have a bit of scaling, and I do have a bit of dex, so... I want to get a Great Bow and kind of compare performance with the, uh... I know where to get a Great Bow. I know where to get two Great Bows, actually. Um, but I haven't found one yet, myself. Yeah, you just have to grind a Great Bow user. So if you know... Some of those, you'll know where to go. No precious item ahead. Are you kidding me? Hey, T, wait for the sub. There's nothing in here? Interesting. I have not found any cute dresses in this game. Honestly, like, this is the cutest thing I've found. I'm pretty starved for stuff that's cute. This is a kind of a dress. <laughs> uh, there's also, wait, I guess this, this also maybe qualifies. <laughs> Lord's clothes. I haven't found anything uh, cute, basically. But I also haven't really been looking. I feel like most of the interesting stuff comes from, like... Classically in Souls, it comes from either NPCs or, uh, like, quests. Not quest lines. Um, NPCs or, like, you just find a full suit of something cool in a specific location. And I have not really found any of that kind of thing in this game. Here. Oh, okay. There's a door down here. Okay, so that thing's kind of guarding this. I'm gonna explore this little area first, though. Can I get up there? Yeah, okay. Anything else in here? Golden rune. Howdy, fellas. Whoa! Jumping? I'm surprised I can hit these guys from here. jump down until I'm sure there's a way to get back up. Okay, yeah, stairs. Stairs are the classic way of getting back up. Fan favorite method. Uh, God, there's so many of this guy. I've definitely been surprised by uh, foes with ups several times so far. Uh oh. Wet spell. Yeah. Boy. Oil. Fine. Wet. 
we're not fine. <laughs> Getting bopped with a giant bubble in the back of the head and then also <laughs> turning around and there's a stabbing guy. Quite cruel. Uh, is there a way to get down from up here? There may not be. I assume this goes up. No? Okay. Well, it's good to know that this is just a shortcut that doesn't go through the ant cave, I guess. Oh, so many fucking guys. I'm just gonna run past him. Sorry, fools. I got places to be. Oh, this is also a different way than I came last time. I guess this is the front door. Good thing I came through the side, because I don't think I would have been able to kill that thing from here. Necessarily. Pardon me, folks! I just want this beautiful sprig. Thank you. Alright, you all can just have... You can live your life in here. That's fine. I'll leave. I'll leave. This is your place. Oh! There's a... Merchant? Is a map? I'm afraid those guys are going to come up here and hurt this merchant, so I actually do need to hurt at least some of them. I'm a little weaker now because I, uh, I don't have my plus five everything anymore. And I don't wish to spend another. A lot of kills. Can I whip this? Nope. Keep trying every time I see one. Is someone there? A customer? Well, how long has it been? Mm -hmm. Gravity stone chunk. Oh yeah, I haven't found any like gravity spells yet. Cookbook. Oh, you can buy the prisoner helmet in here. Hell yeah. Celestial dew. Carry out absolution at the Church of Vows. This seems potentially useful. I don't know. Perfumer. Maybe that's for, uh, for getting forgiven for sins. <coughs> oh, as a merchant for every starting class gear set. That's cool. Damn, you live like this? You sleep in this? Roots. Is this all that's in here? Didn't expect merchant. Yeah, me neither. I saw a tweet today that was uh, that said that um, George R. R. Martin's contribution to this game was all the messages on the ground. He wrote all of them, and that's been enhancing my opinion of the messages a lot. Like you know, uh, if you've ever watched like a talk about the development of Breath of the Wild, they had like a system when they were developing the game where um, 
devs could place messages on the ground uh, in the game world for other devs to look at and be like, it might be fun if we did so-and-so here, or like, it's really cool how you can see so-and-so, or it would be cool if you could see so-and-so, etc. That's what I imagine uh, GRR Martin did, but then they just left them all in. Yeah, that's right, it was like a dev version of Miiverse. Um, is there literally any? I mean, I guess I can just kill all these guys. Ugh. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna pop this in. Oh. Not quite two hit is much worse than not quite one hit. Oh, ouch, ouch, you hurt me. So it's probably for the absolution thing on the merch. Or actually, I guess it might have been one of the, um, could have been one of the recipes too. I didn't look at what I got. Oh, this guy's alive. <laughs> I feel like enemies don't take fall damage in this game, which is a little sad. Okay. Um, what did I what did I get for crafting? I wish that it marked like new recipes in here. I think perfumer stuff is the boluses, maybe. Found by hunting owls. I don't know any hunting owls. <coughs> okay, so they do take fall damage. It just happens so infrequently. Oh wait, there's a tab. Perfume arts. Oh, okay. Acid spray mist. Use FP to release acid mist from the mouth. Cool. And the other thing was like a... Was it a armor's cookbook? Or a... Might have been a... Oh, click left stick for sort options? Uh... Oh, wait, you... All right. Hmm? I don't think it actually has a recently. Oh, it's in the, it's in the description. Okay, all right, that's useful then. I should be checking that key items. It's back this way. Oh, here it is. Okay. I see. Order of acquisition works in inventory, so I can go in here, and then this. Oh, it's fun. That's something very fun about that in the key items list. It's like, ah, here's the order I got all the items in. All right. Acid spray mist. Thaw frost boluses. Stimulating boluses. Okay. Thank you. I've learned. Okay. Well, if if someone if someone made a trip in here specifically to get that special little juice from this this special little man. Maybe I'll grab that. Something else. Might be good to have. I guess these are also a little bit useful. Potentially. Yeah, does it not say anything down there? Yeah, it just has simple view on right click. Right stick click. Thank you, Evan Online, for five coin. A message of dot dot dot. Hi, I'm not gonna watch much today, probably, probably oh, because I got Elden Ring myself. Please enjoy your stream, my friend. Thank you. Enjoy Elden Ring. Enjoy nine 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 hour action RPG. An item. Shield grease. Mm. Of 
right. Oh wait, there's like another another path over here. Oh, and uh, one of these. Lost grass discovered. Also, item. No, this is just message. Wait. Okay. Was secret? It's just a hole. Ah. I'm also shocked that I uh, that I did not miss this. <coughs> really, the only reason I found it is because there's a river going into it. A little creek. Oh, I need the RC car for that hole. Okay, that makes sense. This is a lot of red. Eh, just gross. Oh, these ants don't hurt you? Oh well, let me let me find stuff like that out myself. Don't just say stuff. Now that I know that information, I have no choice but to act. Immunizing horn charm. Is that there? A talisman? Oh, yeah. Raises immunity. Okay. I don't know what that means. <coughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Crystal dart. Ah, boys and resist. Okay, thank you. I do love how on the status screen there's like immunity, robustness, focus, vitality. And I guess I can actually just uh, go over here and find out what the fuck those do. <laughs> Poisons and rot. Um, blood loss and frostbite. Sleep and bouts of madness. Death. Okay. I think having a high enough vitality should just give you like a second chance when you get struck. Not just the death status effect. Oh, Ghost Clover. That's nice. I haven't upgraded any of my spirits yet because um, I'm not sure which ones are good. I have found a few more spirits. Let there be life. All the more bug. Oh, bug. Thank you, Stripes Ultimate Edition, for the sub. Thank you for wishing me well on my quest for the Olympic rings. There's a lot of room in here. Okay. Yeah, I, I wasn't sure how limited the spirit upgrade flowers are going to be. <coughs> I'm also sure there's going to be um, a place to farm them, which one of them might be these ants, I guess, because I think that just dropped from a regular ant. But they're infinite. Okay. Oh yeah, I guess they are just like, like if I if I left this cave and came back, would I uh, would this be back again? I don't think I've ever revisited a place that has flowers in it. Okay. All right. Well, I should just be powering up jellyfish then. Are we have frost? Giant ahead? Could this be death? It's actually hard to tell if that's a living being. Okay, it was a once living being. It's decidedly not a statue. Scary decor. <laughs> By the way, is there a way to zoom in with the, um, the binoculars? Or the telescope? Thank you, Cambria and Arjuna, for the sub. So these are... Can't tell if these are 
biological or stone. <laughs> Use two telescopes. It's a little little known strat. Mountain. They do kind of have Bloodborne Messenger uh, DNA. That spirit beckoned to me. Uh, they're rolling around and attacking in here, so... I don't know. D-pad does a little zoom. Let me try it. Oh-ho! Okay, well, let's uh, walk a little further in. Touch blood stain. <laughs> But stains are working every once in a while for me now. I can summon now, which is a bad sign. Okay, all right, all right. A dragonkin soldier of Noxtella. All right, let's test. Okay, fairly strong. <laughs> Get him! Get him, pup! Okay, he's not that strong. Ow. Ah! Okay, he's a little strong. This belt's falling apart. That's so embarrassing. <laughs> Rod and Stray's not doing much. I need to put the jelly back on my bars. I thought I would try the Stray for a bit. But it's um not, not doing much for me, personally. Personally. Where the fuck is this? <laughs> Where is this? Is it this way? Is it always mushroom? Thank you, Ice Applaud, for gifting a sub to Meat Man the Ace. First off, confusion. Okay, it's through the here. Through the here. <laughs> oh, now it has a fog door. Oh man, does that mean that the boss is going to be active as soon as I walk in now? Well, yes, actually. <laughs> Jelly going in. Chomp. Yow. Ah! All right, get him, Jelly. Fuck him up, fuck him up. My targeting is bad in this fight. Okay. Ugh. I hate fighting big things that are crawling like this because I feel like it's very hard to get close enough to hit them. Did I pick up my stuff? I did. Not that it matters. You know what's nice? I have so much fun playing this game, and it's so easy to just like go and farm if you want to, that whenever I die and I have a bunch of souls on me, I'm usually just like, that's fine. Now I don't have to worry about it. <laughs> did I really need those souls, runes? Probably not. All right, Jelly, let's fucking go. Where's my goop in this room? Oh God, my goop is so close to the foe. Uh. 
sappy. You punch her. Still living. Uh oh. That doesn't seem good. <laughs> I was right. Oi. <laughs> Frostbite. me. Hmm. It sucks to get trapped. Jellyfish really is the best summon that I've found. I'm gonna read the jellyfish's description now, now that you've told me to do that. Now that you've mentioned that there is one. Flaming spirit that illuminates. Friend of tears, the jellyfish girl searches for her distant home, will bravely spew poison at foes on her summoner's behalf. It seems her name is Aurelia. Ah! She really is the best one. Okay, all right. Confirmed. She's so fucking brave. No, 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 no. <laughs> Yum. All right, Aurelia, you got this. I need to disappear behind this pillar for a sec. Okay, I need to not get into this guy's zone like that. Ow. I, the, she, the jelly, has been my, my only hope <laughs> against the many bosses. Because she provides the, like, secondary target of summoning a co-op spirit without causing the huge, uh, the huge HP buff that I hate so much. <coughs> Are people drawing the jelly? If so, that's great. Where's my goop in here? Oh god. I thought I grabbed it! Oh, she saved me. Ow. Well, 
That was a, an attempt to save resources by using urgent heal early on. Oh man. What? <laughs> Every time I get stuck under him, it's bad. Oh yeah, skeletons that get back up is, uh, that's also smart. I don't think I thought about the fact that spirit skeletons would do that. I don't think I thought. I wish I may. I miss I'm. Wow, I can't talk. I wish I may. I wish I might. Beat my boss. I wish to fight. This is my incantation of winning. You have to fuck it up the first time you say it. That's part of it. Give me this, give me this, give me this, give me this. This good brew. Ow. Ow. <laughs> Where? Oh, there. Um. Alright, Pillar does not protect from that. Man, there's not a lot of opportunities to hit him during phase two, feels like. Man, my goop is gonna be all the way on the other side of the arena this time. I might as well just give it up. I shan't focus on it. If I keep having trouble, I will... <sighs> I'll swap over to the Bloodhound Fang. <laughs> Hate to do it. I don't like... I don't like... <laughs> being pigeonholed into using the same weapon for the whole game, because it's too good. Do your thing. Haha, I said I was going to not get it, but I lied. <laughs> All right. Thank you. 
Ups. Hey, where'd my jelly go? Did I just not summon her? Did I forget? Uh... <laughs> I tried to summon her. Yeah, this, uh, actually, here's what I'm gonna do. This does not feel like a fight where I'm gonna... Well, wait, there's no... Touch Grace here. Okay, well, I'll go back to Grace next time I die. But, um... Might be useful to have more flasks of health, since I don't think I'm gonna be using a lot of spell. Well, actually, Phase 2 might require more spell from me, now that I'm thinking about it. Although, I don't know that lightning is going to do much to him. Hey, did that fail? That must be that must be what happened last time. Can you move? Can you move, please? <laughs> oh, I can target his leg. I don't know why I wasn't doing that before. Bumped into his shockwave. <laughs> the entrance to this area? Uh, Ainsel River? Wow, this is like a whole area. I guess this is why I didn't know about this, because I don't think I've ever been in, like, a place with a map. The entrance was called, um... Uh... Ainsel River Well. Ainsel. I like Ainsel better. We'll say it that way. I need to move forward a little bit. Then summon Aurelia. Then get my goop. This might be a shield battle, actually. Jumping is not dodging. This might surprise you. I think another problem, well, another uh, source of me not doing so well is I don't use the shield enough. <laughs> yeah, I think that's like a good, uh, a good caveat for the, the stakes of America. The stakes of America. Cool wielding. Power stancing curved greatswords. Yeah, blocking is really good in this game. <laughs> Between guard counters and like just negating damage. The classic effect of blocking. 
Where's my goop? Oh, Christ. Thank you. Hey. Lay off. I think uh, Mira uses a shield, and that kind of reminded me, like, oh, whoa, why? Right. Shields are a thing. Shields are, like, <laughs> instrumental to success at times. This guy reaching in the ground a lot. Too. of my noises of combat. <laughs> I'm fine. Oh wait, he's gonna do something. Oh, he's not. Okay. for dangerous healing. <laughs> move. You know? Got him. I get the feeling this guy is weak to fire. Frozen lightning spear? <laughs> what? Stabs with ice lightning spear from above. Has a hell of a cost. Thanks. Thanks for complimenting my dodge rolls. Pretty expensive, but yeah, I have a lot of faith. After Supple Tail, I believed. What's in here? Great Ghost Glove Wart! That's what I yell when I'm surprised. <laughs>
Oh, you can leave through here. Well, you can <laughs> you can leave in a sense. Hey, wait. There's a grace down there. Where am I? I don't think I've seen that spot yet. You know what I wish? I wish that, um... It, oh, that breaks after a while. I wish that if you used uh, the prattling pate, that uh, others would hear it from your spirit. <laughs> it became a Banjo-Kazooie cheat castle code. There's a lot of blood here! What happened to these guys? What'd you do? Alright, what happened to this one? This one died during the fight, I guess. This one? What is that hat? I really need to find a better helmet. I want a fun helmet. Although I like my, uh, my chain one, obviously. <laughs> All these guys must have seen each other's bloodstains, right? Yeah, I don't know. I, today's the first day that I've had bloodstains consistently working, so that's cool. I guess they fixed whatever was wrong with them. I accidentally activated one the other day. <laughs> and I got so scared, like, my heart dropped because I thought it was a red phantom that, like, appeared out of nowhere. Oh, there was a server reset last night. Okay. Oh, there's a there's a grace here. Hey, you know what? I made it out of there with all my souls too. Runes. I can get a point. I don't really know what else to put points in. I like faith. I'm faithful. I could put it into literally any of my survival stats. Or even mind. Mind would be great. Although I wish that you got more mind. From or more FP from from each point of mind. Only getting three makes it tough. <coughs> yeah, put it in the pizza. I want to learn about Frost Spears. Oh, it increases more past 20 mind? Shit! Fuck! That's fine. That's so fucking cool. That takes about half of my FP. But maybe that's fine. It, it's good to go... It's a good spell to go in the, uh, the fourth slot. My fourth spell slot. I have uh, focus points? I actually don't know. I truly don't know what it stands for. Foul points. <laughs> FP stands for, for powers. I could believe that. Uh, okay, so let's see. How do we, how would I get down there? So that's this. I guess uh, from over here. I. Uh, mm. What the? F this place is huge. So maybe go back here, pop through the, uh, well, wait, what about this? 
that actually connected or is that just... Okay, it is focus points. Yay! I guess that's just like stuff that's up there. <coughs> there is even a ground pound. You can, you can do your famous hip drop. Okay, I'll work back here. <coughs> Foilet paper. I'm gonna go right here, actually. Because it looks like there's maybe a little... A little more area through here. Oh yeah, there was, I think. I love the rolling R1 attack for whips. It's like this towel whip. It's the longest range move that it has, and it's weaker than just pressing R1, but it's so long. Teleportation. Okay, so let's go this way. Ill omened creature. Oh, ill omened creature. Moment. Ah, uh, left. And then monster! What the? Are they- No! Not basilisks! No! Why would you put them here? They're worse than ever! Wow, their eyes actually look like eyes now. Look at his little mouth. Can you see it? It's like a little Kermit mouth. <laughs> oh, yeah, maybe it's just like a row of teeth. Yeah. I think I might have made them slack jawed. All right, anyway. It is a creature of sport to me. Mm, Formic. Why is it always ill omened creature? Futility. Oh, do they not have any attacks besides the rock stink? Okay. This weapon's actually great for fighting these. Just gotta be patient and wait for the rock stink to wear off before continuing through. Well, the thing is, here's the the trick of it. Ha! Ah! Ah! Ha! Uh, that's Komodo hype to me. Uh, the trick of basilisks is that they're based on uh, the real basilisks from the real world that look exactly like this. So that's why they look the same in Dark Souls and in Elden Ring. They're just based on the real animal. Are these basilisks? Am I saying the right word? I'm having a moment of self-doubt. Soap. Soap looks awesome on this game. Is it? Yeah, okay. Removes filth and accumulations on the body. <laughs> True! Okay, yeah, that's what they were in Dark Souls. For some reason I was thinking I was getting them confused with like some other monster. Somber Smith. Dead end, and then no jumping ahead. I don't believe it. Be wary of something incredible. Seems like this is not on the map. <laughs> Whatever this is. <laughs> Feels like a Scarlet Rot area. Don't see any platforms. I guess this is just a weird little peak. Hmm. Okay, thank you. Pepto-Bismol Cavern. 
Oh, that was the that was the dual wielding. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, they made it through the boss. Congrats. That was the dual curved swords person. Curved great sword. All right. So that's that. I need to go back through the the rock guy room. <coughs> down. Ghostbusters 2. Slime. This slime, it's personal. I'm going the wrong direction. Whatever. Let's just warp. <laughs> Slurp. Gulp. I am once again drinking Green Dragon sugar-free energy beverage. Yeah, I need to uh, make more use of the Rainbow Stones. Which is to say, any use whatsoever. Wait, can I not actually get over there from here? I don't actually think I can. Whoa, rolling. Ow. Okay. Well, you ever just... Okay, there is stuff down here, though. Hey, is there any way to upgrade armor in this game, by the way? I don't remember if Dark Souls has armor upgrades, usually. Not that you found? Okay. It was in 1 and 2. Because I do like being able to power up stuff that I think looks good, but... I think altering is just for... it just makes it not have a cape anymore. I don't think it actually does anything to stats. Or maybe it does, I don't know. Oh, it makes tiny stat changes? That's interesting. Interesting. Bugs. Hey. Makes it lighter and slightly weaker. It's sort of the opposite of an upgrade. Hey. Yeah, just leveling up typically uh, increases all your defenses in Souls games. A teensy bit. Although it seems like there's like a pattern to it in this one. Like you don't always get uh, defense increases in all the defenses when leveling. I haven't really paid attention to when it does what though. Still no item. So wearing heavier armor does, uh, it does provide more defense, more mitigation. But it's like, it's prorated a bit, I think? Um, let me make sure there's no guys around here and then I'll show you what I mean. <coughs> I mean, you definitely always get smushed, but on the stats screen there is damage negation. So see how there's, uh, like for physical, there's 15.821. I think that this is based on nothing, but I think that's a percentage of damage that you're getting rid of. Um, and that goes up as you increase more armor, but it's not like a one-to-one. -one, uh, actually, it might be one-to-one -one of how much armor you have from everything. Yeah, I think it actually is. So all my armor stuff maybe just adds up to... Well, no, it doesn't add up to 15. Does it? No. 
So yeah, there's like some kind of, some kind of, uh, not proration. What's the word? Where you don't get as much the more you put in. <laughs> like the earlier, the early numbers matter more than the late ones. <laughs> Diminishing returns. That's the one. Thank you. Thank you. Because yeah, like if I put, if I put on uh, this plate mail, which I actually probably should, because I'm still medium load. Um. My armor goes up from 15-something to 20. So I get, like, another 5% from that. But this looks cool. So... Actually, why am I wearing... Oh, wait, that's right. I'm still wearing bad gear because when I... Um... I'm not really bad, but... When I swap over to the uh, the Bloodhound's Fang, I have less... Uh... <coughs> less equip load to play with. So let me swap back over to... Slightly better armor. There we go. So that also gets me up to around 20. <laughs> anyway, nothing else down here. If a Canatine is watching and not busy at some point. Did she perhaps come in here and help me by refreshing my water again? I'm such a pathetic little wretch. Can't drink my own water. I hate these men. I'm not afraid to say it. But I'm also not proud to say it. I did find out there is one um, Ash of War that's usable with Whip that I really want. Um, and I'm excited to find it, but I have no idea where it is. I just know it exists, because I saw a post about it. And it is name of Lightning Ram. And apparently, it makes you roll like the sheep. I want that. Uh, palace ruins? So if anyone in chat knows where that is, I would welcome this information. Because I do want it. But yeah, it's, 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 <laughs> it's like the sheep kind of ram. Hang on, how do these guys feel about this cool move? There's so fucking many! Yeah, this smells good. <laughs> I can only use it twice per FP bar, though. Not get stunned. Hang on, what, what do you drop? Probably Formic. No, Firefly. Whee! Ow! <laughs> hey! A golden room. Okay, 
I don't know why I didn't just warp here if I was coming here, but you know. Yeah, AoE spells in this game are great. Honestly, I love everything about this game. <laughs> I'm just having a great time at all times. remember how I was it through do I need to go back here I think I might need to go back here did I ever go right at the start just out of curiosity I did. Okay, so that's a way back. So I do need to go through here. Will these just ignore me? No. Come on down. This way, actually, I need to go this way. Hey! Uh? <laughs> Instant kill? I see. I thought I, I thought I had gotten hit by that before, so I was like not afraid of it at all, because I was like, oh, it'll just do a little damage. Bug juiced. Bug juiced. Come on down. Hello. I can't even target it. It's broken. Big one's still dead. The rest of them don't care. <coughs> All right, here we go. This is the way. Wait, no, it's not. This just goes down, doesn't it? How the? Or is this a different down? No, this is the same. Oh wait, do I just go out there? That's what it is. It's going in circles. Wait, I don't need to roll. I, for I keep forgetting I can jump when it comes to platforming like that. All right, back again and about time too. And this time, not in the mood. 
Let's see ya. Here we go. This is where I was trying to go. So through here. And I can't access my map. I need to get to this. Where is that? Wait, no, I came from that. No, I didn't. Wait, this way? So it should be forward and... Wait, was it just down here this whole time? But that's a dead end, right? Should be like right ahead here. Hmm. Am I missing something? Because all this stuff is like really high up. And I don't think I can get down from this area. Does anyone know if there was like another entrance in the boss arena that I could have continued from? Because I want to explore the other half of this area, but it was not okay. Is is this accessible from here? Do you know, or do I need to come in through like another entrance or something? <coughs> no. Okay. Hmm. Well, I can't use horse in here, right? Nope. Just scratch my ass. Hmm. We know that falling will kill you. There is this. But I don't think, I don't think that connects to the overworld. That's probably just like another weird, uh... Oh, another weird area over here. Hmm. Well, maybe, maybe that's all we can do down here for now. That's okay. There's plenty of other things to explore in this game. See if I care. Um, let's see. What's the, wait a second. I think, I think this is what this entrance looked like on the map, roughly. Or it might be an Ever Jail. But if this is another entrance, then maybe it connects to another waterway down here. I'll go to Bellum Church. Let's get out of here. You got grabbed? I'm sorry to hear that. Let's, uh, get rid of this. Pop this there. Thank you, Sleepy Chief, for the sub.
Cuckoo. Funny little cuckoo knight. I love these guys. And killing them. Where are you going? Oh, he died. Yeah, it's very cute that they're called Cuckoo Knights. That's definitely some kind of building, not an ever jail. Oh, okay, we're fine. <gasps> a peeking guy. Well, Neif, I've got news for you. It is both. <laughs> it is both. It is both of those things. It's it's the first, it's the former, so they can get away with the meaning of the latter. The whip cannot backstab, by the way. It makes me very sad. I keep forgetting. I want to actually like put a um, <laughs> put some kind of a like a small powerful dagger or something, something light, in my one of my hands that I can swap to to do a critical hit with. Because as it is, my only real option when I get a critical opportunity is to do my Yoshi slam. It's not really a gap closer. You do have uh, some level of super armor during it. It's also very funny to do off a cliff. <laughs> it's mostly just strong, so I just kind of use it as my <laughs> as my backstab. First off, look carefully. Ugh, there's not like a good way to get down from here. I think if I go down this way, I get fairly close to the ground. Or I could run up from all the way down here. <laughs> that might honestly be easier. All right, let's do that. Do daggers do extra hit, extra crit? Oh yeah, well not the crystal one, but these. That's cool. They will put me over heavy load because of what I'm wearing though. Here we go. We'll use the misericord. <coughs> Thank you, have fun with your performance. Have fun performing annually. Yeah, whips cannot be parried. Um, I don't know what you mean by not affected by terrain. You can still, like, slap walls with them. Which is kind of annoying, but... I think it's it's still easier to do like a wide attack in a, a small hallway with a whip than it is with like a colossal sword of equal length. <coughs> whip good. Whip fucking good. Ha, ha, ha. 
<laughs> Why do you hate whips so much? <laughs> it's cringe to hate whips, don't you know? Haven't you gotten the newsletter? Whips are so awesome and cool. Yeah, there's even a song about how whip is good. <laughs> They wouldn't make a song about something that's not true. Oh fuck, that's Pistol Shrimp. I don't want to mess with that guy. Oh, you can't do Frozen Lightning Spear on a horse. Actually, I do want to mess with this guy a little bit. Bye. Uh oh, bye. Oh, is this thing in trailers? Ow. Ow, ow. Hey, wait, there's a, there's a grace there. Why did I punch this shrimp? I need that. Ah! Stuck. Please slap the shrimp. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Ashley. Great pull for anyone who watches whatever YouTube recommends them. Thank you, Javid Horner, for the sub. I saw a video, I think, Wayne posted of a pistol lobster doing something cruel, and it was very funny to see it. You can write time for crab, I know that. Which is almost funnier, because it's wrong. Bell from the Blue Lady? Um, thinking about Blue Ladies. I got a bell from, it was, I think, here, maybe. The boss of this crystal tunnel, I think. Oh, a summoning bell. I don't, uh, oh, yeah, 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 I got the bell from, uh, I went back to the first area and went to the church that's, you're supposed to walk into immediately. And I, uh, got it there. <coughs> the pre-sentence mixing Vox vocab... Like, the, the, the concept of using the Vox for messages is very uh, informed by the message system of souls. Hey, who's... Oh, is this another mage's tower? Okay. Oh, you can get it from a store. That's funny. <gasps> Wise beasts? Beasts again. That's noisy. Oh, it's bones. Wait, these aren't actual bones. These are like spirit bones. Well, these are not wise beasts, so I guess I have to keep looking around. <coughs> Ow. Uh-oh. 
Ah! I needed that. These really are zombie ghosts. And they do need to leave this place. First off, madness. In short, could this be a bird? Oh! <laughs> Good. That's a very, very good message. Look carefully. Up. Okay, that's for the same one. Beast ahead and then range battle required ahead. Oh, beast. Hey, what are those like balloons in the distance? <laughs> Certainly a balloon. Are those the puppets? I think those are the awful puppets. Oh man, I'm so bloody. <laughs> My hood got all blooded. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Golden room. Where's this final beast? How many souls did these guys give? Runes? Sixty-five, not that many. No 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 I got time to do this. Oh here's a question. Can you um can you do a critical hit with a left hand weapon? Just out of curiosity. Backstab, if you will. A front stab. Beast ahead? Is there really a beast here? <laughs> Are they sure? I don't think I'd be able to get back up from there. But it is two messages. Oh, there is beast. Thump. Yeah, I, I have a dagger in my right hand now for, for backstabs. Not that I get them very much, but... So much art in here. Yeah, I kind of wish that the radius for disappearing markers by walking 
toward them was a bit bigger. Liar ahead. <gasps> oh! So maybe all of these towers contain these. All these rises. Because I think I found one in another rise as well. Which was down here, somewhere. This one. Yeah. So I wonder if there's one of those in Kalid as well. <laughs> this kind of looks like one. But it's also got like a little extra bit. I think if there's one in Kaled, it would have to be that. I love the red zone. It's great over here. No problems at all. Okay, so let's maybe visit this tree and then try to visit this. Okay, so we can just go here to Dragon Barrow. Uh, to get to North Kalid, you have to go to Celia, and then there's a big staircase you can take that's like um, here, I think. You have to light some fires in the town to undo the, the gate that's on the stairs. Then you can go through. And then you kind of take a winding little path that takes you up here, I think. Uh, it doesn't involve beating the boss or anything. I can just show you real quick. I didn't even know there was a boss there. <laughs> So this is the Site of Grace on the other side of the barrier. So there's this spot here in Celia with a magic tree on top. There's a big stairs down there. It's on um, this end. You Once you light all three fires, I think? Uh, or it might just be one of the fires is linked to this gate. Uh, you can go through here. And there's a grace site. Do this. And this is like a little cliffs overlooking Celia. Keep going up here. There's magic ball. Watch out. <laughs> and there's also a church. Have I gone to this church? I don't think I've actually been to this. Wait, have I? No, I have. It's Church of the Plague. Yeah, um, all you gotta do is... You can kind of, like, jump up this part. Um, but I think if you, like, turn left at the church, you also get up here. Yeah, you just, uh, there's church. Turn left. And you keep going up. Actually, wait, is this how I got here? Oh, yeah. This. <laughs> this is how I got up. I guess I'll see what's over. Uh, wait a sec.
There's construction workers outside, I just remembered. Hope they're enjoying my <laughs> chess reacts. Fort Faroth. Ow. Everything here is so strong. <laughs> I forgot Kaled's still a bit above my power. Hey, why am I... Wait, no, I have attack. Why do I have a debuff? Why am I cursed? Try attacking. Fake. Oh, I walked past the grace. Oh, yeah, I did. Mm. Nah, I haven't watched any of Wayne's stuff. I just saw, like, one clip that he posted of the, uh, the pistol lobster. I'm very excited to go back and watch VODs of, uh... Everyone else's runs of this game, though. There we go. How... how do I...? Must be, uh, above... yeah, there's, like, a hole up there. Okay. Oh, this is a lot of bats, actually. Wait a sec, is that a fucking... Yeah, I think there's a, a boss harpy in here, too. <laughs> maybe, I don't know. I didn't hear her singing, but maybe she's asleep. Oh, God. Yeah, putting, uh, basically, uh, Elden Ring streams from other streamers I watch are going to be for, like, background noise <laughs> when performing other tasks, and they'll be very good for that. Maybe I can just sneak through here? Nope. Take so many hits just to kill one, one guy. <clears throat> yeah, that's a boss lady. Is there a ladder or anything in here? I don't think I really see one. Oh, that doesn't do nearly enough. Ah, uh, stinky. No! Yuck. Whoops. <laughs> okay, I don't want to be in here, actually. I've decided. That's definitely uh, a benefit of having, like, a million viewers. Instant viewer-made content. For all the other viewers to enjoy. I'm just gonna grab my goop and leave. See ya. Okay, uh, let's go this way. We'll ignore the big dragon that I saw. Dragons. 
Let's go see if there's uh, some free tiers of this tree. This might make me fight a boss, but those guys usually aren't too tough. I think this might be a freebie based on the terrain. <laughs> Oh, nope, not a, not a freebie. Not even a little bit. I think fire is actually better against these guys, but... Oh, this guy... Wait, that's my misericord. <laughs> there we go. Hey, I can do that move. Ow. Is she not drinking? There we go. Jelly. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, this guy's putrid. I didn't even realize. Stinky. How dare you? Oh, God. <laughs> okay, so his Yoshi jump creates Scarlet Rot. Mm, probably just the stake is fine. Yeah, there's one that's Flame of Flame. They're all, like, beseeching the flame for a blessing. My goop, is this it? Slap, slap, slap. Ow, I got a little on me. Oh, okay, it creates an area. <laughs> Understood. Scarlet Rod is just like super poison in this. It's toxic. You got me! Alright, maybe I need to not do this on a horse, actually. Yeah, the instant death thing is, uh... Well, there's death, and then there's also... Petrification, probably. Probably also counts for that. Grab my goop. That's not anything. <laughs> uh oh, uh oh. Okay, we're fine. Slap. That's like a full circle of stink. Oh wait, it like undid the previous area, I think. We're gonna try a different strat. Um, yeah. 
We're going to swap out Lightning Bolt for Black Flame, see if that does a little better. Give it the old... Oh wait, I don't have to swap out shit. <coughs> oh, Flame of Frenzy is really cool, by the way. Let me show you this move. Just in case you haven't seen it. Well, first let me show you the description. No, I won't show you the description. I'll just show you. You like it? It burns your eyes. I'm gonna try that. Oh, is it actually madness stat? That's really fun. I assumed it was some weird bespoke eye burn <laughs> status effect. <laughs> I've been too scared to let it build up all the way. Okay, that's good. That's this will be doable. Just a little kiting. That's usually how I beat these guys. So that's fine. Oh wait, right. I forgot! I forgot about that part. I saw some people talking about how Blackfire Enchant is actually really good uh, if you basically treat it as something that you reapply in combat when things are vulnerable. That seems like it could be real. That ain't for me, though. My goop. Why am I carrying around so much goop for this, by the way? I have like 15k goop. Extremely foolish. light. Oh, those crumble. sound? Is there a beep sound? Hey, that was a lot of runes. 
<laughs> what the fuck? That's a lot of runes! That's definitely more runes than I've ever had at once. He's 91k? Oh man, I should have used my funny chicken foot. I'm, hold I'm holding on to these. <laughs> He wasn't even that strong. <laughs> well, okay. Cool. I should uh, go use these before anything tragic could possibly happen to me. I don't think I really have anything I want to, like, buy. I guess I'll just become faithful. Or maybe it's time to put my mind to it. I could get a little more mind. I think the reason I've been pumping faith is not just because of, um, not just because of my damage on my whips, but also I have a stupid giant fireball spell that I want to see that's probably going to be really bad, <laughs> but it requires 41 faith. I bet it's not going to be good. It, I mean, it costs 50 FP, so I can only use it once per bar. If only I could increase the size of my bar. I know. If only there was such a way to do that. Okay, I'll do that. Let's just... What if... <laughs> I feel like the amount of faith, like, scaling I get is not really worth pouring in that many more faith points. Because it only goes up from 347 armament power to 352. But also, oh yeah, I could use it with a rune arc. That's true. So that would let me satisfy my curiosity at least. Okay, I'm going to get more FP. No, I think I can use pretty much anything I want to use. Oh, actually, I might be able to use it already because uh, I'm using a... No, okay. I have Radigan's Scar Seal, which gives me like some free, uh, some free points, but it doesn't do anything for faith, I guess. It's just Vigor, Endurance, Strength, and Dex. <coughs> oh, thank you. Could you also uh, refill my water? Thank you. Kano brought me some raspberries. Nom nom nom. I'll probably... um. Yeah, I think I also have a Faith Boost Talisman. Or no, I have a Potency of Incantations Talisman, which is different. Um, thank you. Okay. Let's get back to that um, thing I was chasing. That blue light. Yeah, that's definitely a tower over there. I can see it now that I'm looking at it. Um, there's another talisman that I, again, heard about from posts uh, that I am thinking I will probably not unequip once I get it. So maybe I'll try and get that today. If I can remember where it is. Um, scoop them up. Oh, it's a graveyard. Give me probably high level runes. Low. High ish. High ish. Okay, not that many. Worst. Yeah, I also don't feel too bad like learning that certain things exist. As long as it's on my terms. <laughs> Um, something I've been enjoying with this game is the fact that, like, I forget if I said this last stream. I keep thinking it and saying it to people. But, like, 
compared to Dark Souls, where it's like, oh, I have this cool idea for a build, but um, the stuff you want to you or like the stuff you need to get to be able to do this build is like locked toward the end of the game. In this, if there's something that you uh, like a build you want to try, you can just look up like how to get it, and then you probably can get it if you are just careful enough with your horse. You can just go all over the world. Hey, this guy's... Get up. Interesting. No door ahead, try Spirit Spring. Oh! Can you just jump into the top of it? Yeah, I already beat the Olympics. I'm in the post-game of the Olympics now. Uh-oh. This is bad. Well, maybe it's fine. Maybe you can get in from one of these side... Things. Oh, you made it! <laughs> it has antennas? Or are these whiskers? <laughs> she she made a funny little strawberry creature for me. Hang on, I gotta take a picture of this for myself. What a treat. Little fruits for my gaming. Oh, maybe I can... get up there? Scarlet rot themed red fruits. <laughs> so festive. Hmm. Well, it does look like there's actually a door up there, so I can probably just get on that. This takes me up high enough. Why did I take fall damage? That's weird. Oh, nope, doesn't go quite high enough. Likely tears. Oh wait, is that a ladder? Did I just see a ladder? No. Just some molding. Is that really not... Okay, there we go. I don't know why I completely slid off it the first time I tried to do that. <laughs> Not here? Be wary of monster. up ahead. Is that a... Oh, it's one of the fucking wizard balls. No item ahead. Well, that's fine. I do hate these wizard balls, though. I don't know what they're going to do in such close quarters. Because, like, outdoors they cause, like, a weird star fall. But in here? Uh, 
know. Actually, you know what? If we're doing this... That's not very strong. Yeah, okay, not that. <coughs> I mean, it might just be fine. I don't know what this blue shit is. Blue shit might literally be nothing. <laughs> this monster might just be environmental storytelling. <laughs> oh, it is hurting juice? Okay, I just wasn't close enough. I guess that's the front door. Okay, well, good thing whip. Good thing whip. Yeah, there was a message like that too, but I I wanted to check. Try left and then try down. I'll try that after I left. After I get my yummy memory gummy. Oh boy! A memory stone. Oh! Interesting. Oh, it's just, oh, I see. This is where the guy is, the hole, the ball. That's funny. Huh. Okay, well, yum. Uh, what else is on my map that I could maybe investigate? I think this little Australia down here is more or less complete. Actually, hang on, I've been in here. There's supposedly something in here that I didn't find. See if I can remember what this place even is. So I think I probably beat this place. Yeah, I definitely beat this place because I remember the archery traps. that. <coughs> well, I'll look through. Hey, wait a sec. <laughs> Why does this one have a guy head? I don't like
like that. Oh. Fine. Ow. <laughs> wow. The imps really got me. I wasn't wary of ambush. Everybody wake up. Yeah, I'm coming back here to check for something that I maybe missed. Maybe didn't miss. I can't remember what was in this catacombs, to be quite honest. Oh, I activated a blood guy. I already beat whatever was in here. Hmm. Maybe, maybe I'm thinking of a different area. I think this is just like a weak guy, weak foe. There's supposedly an NPC and a merchant. A familiar one. Somewhere in a cave, I thought it was this one. But I guess it's fucking not. It's another place, okay. I will attempt to seek that place. So it's not the catacombs. It's, um... Is it up, maybe? Devil's damage. kind of river area below. Mm. Oh, have I been here? Seems not. <coughs> New homing instinct painting. What does that mean? Is it just in... Oh, yeah. The soul of the painter and vestiges of the dead's last moments can be discovered by visiting the location depicted even now. Oh, interesting! So these are like, um... <laughs> are these like the secret pictures in Mario Odyssey? <laughs> Where it's like, find this location. 
Yeah, the hint art. That's what it was called. I think it might be. That's fun. Okay. River area. So wait, like down here? Or is there like a different river? This one? Summon Water Village. Okay. Because down there is where I was with the catacombs, but maybe I just wasn't in the right part of the river. I'll go take a little look. A little looky loo. Wait, is there a side of grace there? Didn't expect grace. What's this one called? Rockwater Coast. There's a jellyfish cave. This is blood slime area. Which culminates in catacomb. Zombies. <laughs> Ow. Eh. Huh? Is there an NPC phantom around here? What? <laughs> okay. Well, come on over, bud. You gotta love the way you feel. Big fucking mistake. <laughs> Bloody finger vanquished. Reduvia. Okay. Ah, this might be what I'm looking for. I always get so scared whenever the game takes my horse away. If you don't kill him instantly, another NPC samurai shows up to help out. That's cute. Cute way of, like, showing you how the mechanic works. <laughs> Fingers keepers. <laughs> you know what they say. There's a little guy in here. These guys are going to hate that I've come to their house. Uh oh, stinky. Oh, I should have equipped uh, antidote spell. Oh, that was explosion fire. Yahoo! Mushroom. Wait, is, is there any? Oh, this way. Uh, 
Sinner ahead. In short, likely traitor. Calmness required ahead. Could this be a friendship? Time for friendship. <laughs> I jumped over it while attacking? That's funny. First off, friendship. First off, you don't have the right. <laughs> A lot of bloodstains in here. Ah, uh, dastard, therefore seek up. It's probably fine. I won't. He's breathing. Patches boss. <laughs> I'm afraid to kill him. Wait, wait, <laughs> okay, there we go. <laughs> Enemy felled. <laughs> Gravel for mercy. <laughs> Sitting with my buddy. Let's talk. Ah. Well, what do you know? You're tarnished like me. Now, now how did I get that wrong? <laughs> I took you for a demi-human or some such. <laughs> but an innocent mistake, I assure you. Do I look like an ape? Well, water under the bridge. Now we're squared up. How about we play nice from now on? <laughs> Ah, eh, forgive and forget. True lady of reason. Just what I like about you. I'm Patches. Patches the untethered. The untethered. Patches like you, only free spirited. Nomadic, you might say. Only for now. Those retired soldiers turned bandits. And they're paying for my gruel. In exchange for my, well, showing them the ropes. But honestly. This looting racket is bloody. He's just squatting in this blood. Frankly, I'm ready to wash my hands clean. Maybe set up a legitimate shop. So don't be a stranger. I'll be ready to wheel and deal come next time. <laughs> don't forget to pop back for another visit, friend. I'll be ready to wheel and deal come next time. <laughs> <laughs> Makes it sound like a slogan. All right. It's next time. Nervously jumping through the room this time. God, what if I just like sat on him during the boss fight and it killed him in one hit? Well, nice of you to drop in finally. It's all a bit ad hoc, but I'm sure you'll find something. And welcome to Patches Emporium. <laughs> Everything's top notch. He sounds so shopkeep. Missionary's cookbook. Sells a parrying dagger. Stonesword key. Some fingers. Market's shackle. Oh! 
That's interesting. Fan daggers. Oh, he sells foul feet. He sells foul feet. I don't know what the music box is. <coughs> oh wait, doesn't that like distract one of the bosses? Something like that? I think I remember reading about it. Mmm. Probably no point to buying it now then. I'll grab these. I've never used one, but someday I'll use one. Script stone, grace mimic, gold pickle. Oh! This lets you craft them. <laughs> I see. I barely remember. It's been so long since playing Bloodborne. That was like pre-pandemic. Or it was like during the very start of it anyway. A world away. I wonder if I should grab this here. I haven't been buying stone sword se seals when I, or stone sword keys when I find them. I just assume I'll remember where all the merchants are and grab them when I need them, <laughs> which is maybe foolish. You know what? There you go, patches. All right. The rest of the shit though is garbage. Bye. It's a script stone. Reveals more messages from other worlds. <laughs> Why would you want this? This is. I killed this before. I killed this exact bear. I don't need to kill him again. I wonder if I'm on Patch's shit list now. <laughs> hey, wait. Is that an ever jail? I don't think I did this. I was a little bit distracted. Yeah, because this is where the map for this part of the world is. So that's technically good. Thank you. Thank you, Patches. Oh, wait. This is a uh, an underground river entrance. Yeah. I was doing other stuff when I was in this area before. There's like a, a an old codger. Definitely makes sense to find this one first. <laughs> oh, wow. This is a long... What the hell? Hmm. That's a beautiful elevator ride. It's so funny that it took Patches teleporting me here to notice it. Because I definitely went here already. Not to this, but to the area in the overworld. Yeah, he's actually helpful. 
Siofra River. I gotta take a bite of my strawberry creature. I've been waiting. Let's see. In this slot, what should I put? Maybe, maybe just dragon fire for now. It has its niche uses. Oh wait, actually, I'm gonna sit at this grace for a sec. I'm gonna hop up for a moment. I'll be right back. Like just a minute. BRB. All right, I'm back. I also grabbed a cereal bar. Home. <laughs> oh, you, you can summon your horse down here. Expect city. <laughs> Sorry, my pillow throne that I sit on got all disheveled. Apologizes to you about this for some reason. I really need to remember to, um, I need to remember to go back to the round table at some point. <laughs> Do you kiss Turba? Silver Firefly. No. <laughs> Didn't expect a message. I think I could hear a uh, scarab. I can hear a sparkling noise. Ah, oh, it's more of these fucking fellas.
Wow. Great synchronization. Ow. Thank you. Thank you so much. over here? Yeah. Yeah, you. Can I one-shot these guys with flame? No. Regrettably. All right, everybody come over here. Everybody bundle up. Okay, nobody's gonna bundle. That's fine too. Hey! Smithing stone. I don't remember what uh, level of smithing stone I need to pump my whip up more. <coughs> up there? Didn't expect high road. That's, that's a very active hitbox on your spear there, my friend. Yeah, I was always kind of disappointed in the whip in the other games, but here... Fun of the sun. Golden ring. The explosion noise is so game maker. When will I learn? Uh oh. <laughs> really playing with fire here. No alluding to things, please. 
of the side path that I was on before. Yeah, it is. Okay. So when coming back here, I can just skip all that shit. If I need to. Come back here, that is. <laughs> Everyone remembers the classic image of Lucy pulling the spear away from Charlie Brown at the last second. Unforgettable. Budding horn. You, how do you do it? <laughs> Why are they all using the horse? The last of their ilk. No item ahead. Okay, thank you. Time to get this beetle. Seems familiar. Yeah, someone said earlier that they did a uh, server maintenance recently, so. Oh shit. Slap. There we go. What you got for me? <gasps> oh! That's a spell, though. That's a sorcery. What happened to this dog? <laughs> oh, it's fine. Yeah, get a water spell. That's for sorcerer. Yeah, seems like a fun treat for sorcerers. You could probably rush that whole area on a horse very easily, because these guys are slow as hell. Mm. Later, fellas. I have to go inside stairs. Oh. She's so messy. Balloonga. <coughs> Take a sip. Balloonga whale. I'm also going to take a bite. No, the horse is very smart and knows how to do stairs really good. I love the uh, the Undertale cave ceiling. Still no light. Oh 
horse. Fortnite. I like how um when you check a message, it tells you how many appraisals it's gotten, but not what type of appraisals. By the way, why is it always crab? Bee sliver. Yum. Crab slap. Oh, map. Not map? Why did I think that was a map? Ah! No, not that! <laughs> okay, maybe that. <laughs> I had intended to use my jumping whips, but <laughs> turns out that's fine. That's also good. I'm constantly forgetting I can even do that. <coughs> Behold gorgeous view. I really love this underground area. What the hell? I guess like the uh, the roots of the Erd tree would probably be like down here, right? Oh, that scared me. <laughs> I thought that was from the game. Felt the effect. Sail for a riverbank. Whoa. That sounded cool. Okay, this is a map, right? No, it's not. Oh, there's like water elementals down here. Little water sprites. There's animals beside crab. Crab's also here, though. Sound of me dying. Oh. <laughs> Ow. It only hit my horse, I guess. Light ahead. This area is so cool. What the? <laughs> Sound of my eyebrows going up very quickly when I find a ghost minotaur. I've seen people with minotaur uh, horns, so I guess this might be where it comes from, or something related to here. Arteria leaf. 
Inverted Hawk Heater Shield. <laughs> Inverted Hawk is the emblem of the Company of Slaves ordered to explore the Eternal City. I think I like how this one looks a little better. Yeah, red. <laughs> yeah? You got something you want to say? Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it sounded like a response, so it's fine. Old Fang. Thin beast bones. I, um... Oh, here's the river. Whoa. I thought I just heard the, the light party sound, but I think I was just combining a bunch of sounds into the same sound in my head. Okay, this is extremely not connected to this underground river. I guess I'll go over here first. What does this say? Seek fire and then boss ahead. <laughs> I got fire for days, no problem. Oh, maybe I need to seek fire first? Maybe there's some kind of allusion to activating this boss. Could also try slapping it. Let's give it a slap, shall we? Well, it bleeded. Maybe just one... <laughs> Oh, you can examine off your horse? Okay, let's see. No. I'll just go look around. That was sand. Sands. It's probably fine to do this. wasn't fine to do that. I'm imagining the word water but spelled with an S instead of a T. Wasser. I think that's good. Is that actually German for water? What if it works this time? Okay. Hey, there's a little treat down here. Just a little more, just a little further. So glad for spirits in this game. 
Hornbow. Wait, is there something on the other side? <gasps> there is. I know, <laughs> I know Trinkin is Trinkin because of the, the kid who says, yippee, and he talks about Cola Trinkin. He loves to play Fortnite and drink Cola. Uh, uh oh. God, what is what is summoning? I'm alive. Help! You die. Ow. You shot literally an arrow straight through my skull. <laughs> Bro, that's so fucked. Why do you do that to me? It did break him. Okay. Hey, ow. Can you fucking cut that out? Ah! Raymond. It's for Raymond, but I'll take it. <coughs> Dwelling arrow. Try left. There's a fire down there. Uh, is that a person? It's a fighting knight. Stoneswood key. in this menu. <laughs> okay, that is uh, not an invisible bridge situation. Confirmed. Oh, wait. Well, that was kind. <laughs> kind of them. To do that for me. But, um... From here...
I don't... This doesn't feel real. <laughs> oh wait, I can just get back up from here. Okay, that's actually no problem. Hmm. Is it possible to make that jump? Because I don't think... I don't know if I can land on that thing ahead. I think I just tried and failed. I'll try it again, though. Oh, never mind. It's fine. Easy. <coughs> Where was that wind? Okay, it's down there. Yeah. There's also entrance down there, which I don't know how you would get to. Because I don't think you can... Oh, wait. Who I? Ah! He! Woo! Okay. I guess you don't take fall damage from these. I thought you had to land back in the wind in order to be exempt from fall damage. But that does not appear, appear to be the case. What's this? Just a shiny bit. Oh, I'm stupid. <laughs> I forgot. I forgot myself. Oh, I see. If you land on a lower place than the place you jump off from. take damage. That's scary. Uh. Minotaurs do not interact. Oh man, is my shit gonna be up in that tower? It's going to. It has to be. Because I was up there for like a long time. Alright, let's see. It's a good theory. That's a scary spot for that to be. Not here. <laughs> See a minotaur down there. Okay, if I jump back down into that, I'll be fine. Alright, so... I think what I need to do, maybe, is... Oh, yep. Okay, here we go. This is the strat. <laughs> Very dumb looking, but... Ah! <laughs> okay, hang on. Where? It's like a little bit... There we go. It's just Dwelling Arrow. Is that all that's in here? Oh, I guess you can fall in here from up there, too. So this is like an exit, if you notice it. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! Uh-oh! Okay. Hey! All 
Alright, what's over here? That was a strong one. <laughs> I think that guy has a great bow. Oh man. There's one over there too. <laughs> Oh Christ, okay. Never mind. We're gonna start from a bit further back. Ah! God, my tail. Nothing supple about this one. Shot in the back with a giant arrow! I thought I was so cool. Are they just dudes? They seem too big to just be dudes. If I'm going to be shrieking. Wailing. Where is this? It's just a little bit further away? Because I was just like over here. <laughs> oh, it's like up. Maybe. Mmm, Formic. Okay. <coughs> I wonder if there's a... Grace up here. manner of beetle is that? Is it a potion beetle? Scarab. Yeah, I think. That looks a bit familiar, I think.
Oh boy. Okay. Well, let me look around for a, <coughs> a grace to touch or. Yeah, if I can learn a cool lightning from it, then it's fine. Slap this beetle for no reason. <coughs> Ugh, the men. There's so many of the men in here. Crab. Eagles. Item I had. Well, it doesn't seem like there's... Uh, oh, That's not the turn. Uh, also, I can hear a beetle from here. Hang on. This is fucking scary. I don't know where I'm hearing beetle. It might be like on top of these walls. You can hear him from a long way. Away. <coughs> or maybe inside here? Because I think this is a building. Oh, it's just a blue potion beetle. Fuck that. If there's no grace up here, then hopefully there's at least a shrine. Or not a shrine, a, a stake. I don't know if I saw one, but... Oh yeah, there's like this weird Anne Orlando looking building over here. Got the slopes. Anything down here? <coughs> like... Oh, tree. Mm, but if I jump down there, I won't be able to get back up, I think. <coughs> I'll just have to remember that. Yeah, that looks like it's like the reward for going through the Minotaur Gauntlet. Well, a Minotaur Gauntlet. Okay. We'll just... We'll remember that's there. I have a bad... Bad, bad task to complete before I... Jump down there. <coughs> Alright, I'm just gonna have faith that there's a stake of America up here. Probably should have healed, huh?
Oh, okay. <laughs> One hit then. I wasn't expecting him to be a stronger one. I'll be honest with you. Okay, well, there is one of these down here. I knew I should have stuck to just one hit per dodge. <laughs> Fighting it on horseback will be useful maybe once it uh, <coughs> enters phase two, but phase one I want dodging. So maybe just chug this now. Oops, not bad. Oh, come on. <laughs> bad start. I feel like most of the time when I think I can jump a sweep, it usually just ends up killing my horse. Or stunning my horse and knocking me to the ground. I'm never sure which is happening. Are you sitting on my... yes. Free damage. That's different than what the other guy was doing. Yeah, okay. I won't 
give in to the temptation of horse kiting. I'll be good. I'll be. I'll get good. I'll be skilled. There are a lot of bosses in this that I feel like fit the moves like a pip puppet tries to kill me uh, archetype of creature. And you know what? It's good. I wanted to try to do a, a, a sit. I wanted to hip drop him, but it was not a good time to try it. I gotta do it when he like falls over big time. Yuppie. <laughs> oh yeah, I didn't uh, check what those other new tiers I got were. I forgot. face. I think this is definitely a case of uh, their body is just not conducive to moving around upright. To not go for that last greedy slap. <coughs> Wish I had more defense or health. Oh wait, I can have more defense or health, but it'll only be for one try, so it has to be the run. It's gonna be like right behind him, isn't it? Oh Christ. Pick it up! What are you doing? <laughs> Don't use that! That's no weapon!
Okay, well, more defense and health did not actually help me. Even a little bit. It's so difficult to imagine having defense in this game. Feels like, at least in my experience, this is the game where, like, passive mitigation has mattered the absolute least. My Adventures of Dracula's Bounce House Savage? I don't know what you mean. Oh, Savage Rating in F14. Uh, we're still on the Firebird. Making progress, but... We only play t twice a week, so... Takes a bit. We also missed a week because I got really sick and couldn't energy. I'm gonna get torn up. Oh, okay. Dodge him too early for that one. <laughs> I'm gonna try doing just a complete shithead running around run of this. Curious if it's viable at all. Well, I'll run up and slap for the free damage at the start, but after that. Three strikes. <laughs> the problem is he's he's honestly very fast. And if I have to slow down to cast anything. Will not be good for me. Okay, I basically need to need to play the same way as I was on foot. Just uh, using horse stuff. Wow, he really just reaches.
Also, a little hard to target him. Maybe if I target not his legs. <laughs> Yeah, it seems like jumping is okay for this. <laughs> well, I think that's actually... That might be the strat. But he's quite reacher. He's reaching. The joke of horse is that there's no iframes on anything it does. So. Um. Hi. I don't want to go left. That's scary. That's not the direction I usually go. Oh, wow. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it seems like cannot dodge that um, long arm by going around. So maybe I need to simply get far away when I see it coming. If I see it coming. That way. There we go. <laughs> okay, seems like that's not maybe just too fast for me to do literally anything about. Uh, pardon me? <laughs> uh, fucking excuse me? <laughs> Network status check failed. Starting in offline mode. Okay, well that's fine, I guess. I wonder if they're doing server maintenance. Bad timing, though. No, I did not beat Radon. Also, be careful asking me if I've done things, because if it's something I don't know about, I don't want to learn from someone asking me if I've done it. Like I said, I don't mind learning stuff, but it's it's if it's on my terms. So like if I'm looking up stuff, that's fine. But if people just like casually reveal things. I see, I see. That's actually a good strat. I'm just cautious. <laughs> so I felt the need to say it anyway. Emerging strats. Strats. 
strats killed. You know, there's nothing stopping me from leaving this arena. <laughs> I've just noticed this. As far as I can tell. I'm gonna try something. No climbing, but <laughs> I'm pretty sure he would just like clip through this with his attacks. Targeting is throwing a fit, but... Hey! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Look, if you didn't want me to do that, don't put this here. in that spot. <laughs> what the? Like, fizzled out. Changed the world his final message. Hey. Silly guy. Great. Enemy felled. Dragon halberd. Whoa. That scared me. Dragon kin soldiers never attained immortality and perished as decrepit, pale imitations of their skyborn kin. Interesting. Oh yeah, wait, does it have... I guess it's not actually in Wreath with both Ice and Lightning. It just looks like it is. Yeah, just a normal weppy. Anything cool in here? America's Scar Seal.
Oh, this one raises the the magic stats. Uh huh. Very nice. I don't want to give up my strong jump attack right now, though. It would be enough to try out the fireball, though. Yeah, you're right. All right, well, let's go get that tree. Unless... That's not too far to fall, right? Praise seed. cave over here. Finally, something behind a waterfall. Freak. Freak. building. I guess it's not important, or maybe even a building. Might just be like a dam or something. Sorry for cutting. Oh fuck, they're looking at me. Jesus. Hi. Grace, touch. Is relaxing. Just letting it take its course. Letting it run its course. Can I do this yet? No. Can I do this? No. Okay. Hang on, I want to see what that funny fireball does. Oh, it uses two slots. What the? Never seen such a thing. Maybe it's really good. Blow my cover, goat.
Oh, it like hovers until it gets near something, I think. Can I block this arrow? Yes. All right, you're actually, you're actually nothing. Ow, that was a normal arrow. Grappling? That's fun. <laughs> yeah, there have been a few things like that where it looks magic but is pure physical. I can't think of the other instances, but... I feel like that's happened to me before. Ah! Awesome. Love that. I'll get my coins back, no trouble at all. For me, <laughs> it's easy to accrue coins. And even to get them back if I lose them. Here we go. Why did I not spend any of these souls? Runes? up. Oh, four. Hey, I think I can finally afford to summon that, uh, that special hero guy. <laughs> That's exciting. Maybe I'll put him in one of these slots. Oh yeah, I also have Mad Pumpkin Head. He's even more expensive than this hero guy. And by hero, I mean he's banished. How many mind point? How many FP do I have? I have enough. Ooh. Put that guy on, so. I'll be ready next time I'm able to summon stuff. Clarifying horn charm. Raises focus. Two little buddies are here. Howdy. One for you. And one for you. Oh, up? Yeah, focus makes you not sleepy. And I think it does one other status effect. How many stone sword keys do I have left? Three. This one's way faster than the one I came in on. Where is it going? Caleb? Can't say I expected to pop out all the way over here. Huh, yeah. It's really fun that they, just by nature of how this game works, had to make the geometry match. 
Is there a jail around here? Or is this just pointlessly a uh, worms area? Usually these guys are around jails, but maybe they're actually just protecting the well. Uh. <laughs> He's got the Minotaur great bow. Ouch, oof, ow. Hmm. All right. I forgot I just saved here, so we're good. Souls. <laughs> Shoot me, idiot. Break your stupid feet off. Oh, wait, there's another one that will shoot me from over there. That's scary. Uh oh, I'm dead. I'm alive. Throwing tantrum. Here we go. Okay. <laughs> Shoot your stupid arrow. Hey, is that a big living jar? Because it's got its arms crossed, which I've only seen living jars do. See how much it does for him. Don't. <laughs> yeah, the whip uh, does not deal a lot of stun. Oh. 
No drops? Okay. Hopefully this is a friend. PC invaders? Alright, uh, which of these guys seems weakest? You're probably fucked up. Actually, you're cool looking. You look a little bit like my character. Knight of the Great Jar. Okay, well, let's pick, pick one, I guess. Tried to backstab. Uh, you have a lot of HP, man. That hurt and killed me. <laughs> there is a bleed whip. <clears throat> I want it very much. But I don't I don't know where in the game it is, I just know it exists. Are those big guys gonna be back? Am I gonna have to kill them every time I wanna attempt this? Cause that'll be annoying. Uh, come on. <laughs> Strange behavior is my friend. Back for more olive.
<coughs> Wonder, do I have like a big heavy weapon I could use if I two-handed it? Might be better at knocking down. I don't know. I don't know if it would be worth it. Just remembering how long it took me to knock this fucker over. Almost fell into the sea. Take two. Is there any kind of protection on people getting summoned in so that they don't get Backstab right away. Yes. Appears so. Okay, well that was wrong.
Uy. <coughs> Thank you for the well wish. All right, well, now I have no fucking resources for these other two guys. <coughs> But maybe they'll give me a little less trouble than a speedy, speedy type. This one's a spell, though. Well, I guess we'll find out. That looks bad. Oh, it's fine. Aww. Uh, all right. I guess we will find out if I keep my progress through these three guys. <coughs> or if I have to defeat them all one after the other. I wonder if I can get away with not killing the giants. <laughs> what if we try that? I think that'll fly. That's probably fine, right? It'll just introduce a fun, a fun twist on the fights. I hope he doesn't shoot the giant jar. Ah, I don't keep my progress! Oh god. Oh, that does kind of suck. <laughs> hmm. <coughs> well, running past golems confirmed. I'm going to try something. And it's the thing I hate to do. What's pushing me over heavy load? Oh, this probably. No? Oh, this. Okay. Although I want that, so maybe... Okay, 
We'll wear this for now. <coughs> oh yeah, also I could be using guard counter ever. That's also a good point. <laughs> if I used guard counter ever, these guys would probably fall over a lot, huh? I'll use the sword anyway. We'll see. Rest in peace, that runes. Just on my way through. bother me. Stinky. Twice? <laughs> okay. <coughs> Wait, I don't need this on if I'm using the sword, I just realized. <laughs> Silly, stupid. Alright. Uh, I may as well chug a flask. Pop this. That's the downside of using shield. <laughs> okay, so we know I can kill the um, the rogue girl pretty easily. So I guess I will focus on trying to kill this shitty wizard. I'm just gonna run past. I don't need to fucking wait. I'm brave. I'm brave. I'm brave. I'm fucking brave. What? How did you shoot? Oh, wait, the guy behind you shot that. Oh. 
I got tricked. I do have to respect the first one a little bit. That's okay. I'll go back to the pattern I was doing before. Consistency is key. That's, well, that doesn't usually happen, but I think it's okay. Try wizard. The way that curves is so scary. noise okay I think actually swapping to bloodhound fang is not actually helping me so we're gonna go back to my beloved silly weapons try using a rune arc. See if that helps bridge the gap a little bit. A ruin of Kunark. get my zero runes back. Alright. You. Let's do this. Oh wait, I have 184 runes from the, the lovely worms on the way in.
No, stop it. <laughs> Cut that out. Why are you casting so many? I am going to use a rune arc. <coughs> Cuz I feel like this is going well. Oh, I didn't realize that rune arcs fill up all your shit, too. So that's like an emergency healing item if you got a bunch. That's cool. Okay. This guy is a knight type. It's extremely human. Yeah, it is like a humanity. Uh oh! your moves or abilities. Here we go. No. Ah. Uh, one small thing with power stance moves. <laughs> if you start mashing, you'll be in those animations for a long time. So this time we'll do the knight first. Seems like the answer to the wizard guy was just to not let him do anything. But the knight. That'd be a little trickier. Knight hits me once, I'm fucking done for. That's what I've learned. <laughs> I 
Hey, here's a question, um, just completely unrelated to anything that's going on, actually. Uh, so, I think fist weapons in this, if the, I've only gotten the weird light JPEGs, but uh, if those are any indicator, it seems like if you dual wield a fist or claw, um, or if you try to two-hand it, it'll dual wield them instead. Does that mean that there's no power stancing for those? Or does power stancing activate like a different move set? Or is it just those funny light JPEGs that have that effect? Does anyone know? I guess I actually have claws, I just never equipped them. Okay, so so power stancing Like if you if you actually power stance by having a claw and equipped in both hands, it's not any different from just two handing one claw. I think I actually have two things. Yeah, I, I know that they... I didn't ex explain it very well because I was trying to focus, but I know I know how a single claw or cestus works. I'm just curious, like, if you actually manage to equip two, if it's any different. that running attack going, then I'm fucked. Yeah, I saw a Cestus in the shop. That would allow me to test, but I, I can't remember which shop, and I didn't buy it, so. <laughs> I have no way of finding out. Oh, wait. Probably if I equip... Hang on. I get to solve this. I do have to... to well, un unless these aren't considered the same type of weapon. Because they're not in the same category, so I don't actually know. Wait, where is it? Put it in the wrong. Okay, these are not considered the same type. A claw and a punch are different. Okay. So there are two different movesets. That's what you're telling me. Two separate fists is power stance on L1, and when you two-hand a single fist, you can... Yeah, okay. I think I understand. Oh, Dragon Barrow is where the Cestus is. Okay. Was there ever a Souls game where two-handing a fist just made you do a two-handed fist? I feel like it might have worked like that in Dark Souls 1. That's good. I wonder if I could magic the knight. The problem is, I feel like all my faith incantations are too uh, slow to really protect me from just getting dashing attacked. Yeah, the funny fireball doesn't really do that much damage, though, is the only issue. 
I didn't equip my fucking miracle stick. It like barely does more damage than just a uh why can't I use it here? I don't know. That's weird. Barely does more damage than a charge attack, so I might as well just charge attack. Or fuck it up. And die immediately. I just need to be patient. Landing on higher ground while doing a jump attack is really cool looking and silly. Oh fuck. Ugh. The cancels. Polish hammer. I kind of wish that you could do that as like a a move still with fists in this. Should be a weapon art. Oh, I was just thinking I would maybe try equipping the... Um, Frost Lightning Blast, but I guess I left it at home. <laughs> yeah, I'm going kind of long today, even though I shouldn't. I wonder why I couldn't use the my fireball thing. Is it like specifically disabling it during summon animations? Because that would be really funny. No, I don't know what the deal is. Guard break and I wasted it. <laughs> uh, well, I didn't want to do this again! It's fine. that time. <sighs> I think I might need to unequip the ground slam. <laughs> it's very funny, but... Oh, maybe I don't have enough faith? I... Yeah, you're right. You're right. You're right. It's because I unequipped the faith charm. I forgot. Because I wanted to make room for the jumping move. 
Okay, well that's that's fine. All right, Ashes of War. I really don't have any other good shit. I guess Determination is actually probably good for something like this. Storm Stomp is also okay, I think. I'm gonna try that. And this one can have Determination. Although, it's, it seems like uh, your offhand Ash of War will never be usable unless it's a shield. I can't use gold because it'll turn my weapon holy, which will be weaker on most enemies. I feel like things tend to have more holy resist than they do fire for some reason. Also lower uh, base stats, I think, than flame art. You do. If uh, if I choose that, it does not let me choose any element except for holy. The fire stuff will not appear. But the other physical types will. I can show you if you don't believe me, but <laughs> you're just going to have to believe me. Yeah, I assume it works similarly for um, the Sorcery Ice enchant, if there's a knife for that. Probably if you pick like a different... Uh, an Ash of War with an element, it only lets you choose that element. Not Storm Stomp, because it makes me want to use it all the time. How long is the animation for um, Determination, or whatever it's called? Pretty quick. We'll try using this. <coughs> there it is. Ooh, I want to win. I heard the other one, and I was like, all right, time to go.
wasting like all of my flame buff. actually not enough time for me to swap weapons on a guard break. Yeah. Third time's the charm. like, oh, he can only do one swing, then he's tired. He'll never do a second hit. And then he does it. Hmm. What if... This is a stupid idea, but... Poison mist? I don't really know what else I would put in here. I've only used Poison Mist once. And it was just to see what it looked like. So... I'm sure this will work out awesomely. I'm sure this will work out handsomely. I'm really glad I figured out that I don't have to kill these guys every time. <laughs> Imagine how much longer this would have taken to get this many tries in. before.
think he might not get poisoned. I think this guy might not really get poison. I did say it was a stupid idea. Let's see, what other dumb ideas do I have? Oh, I know one. I have a little, little idea. A little small idea. I'll get over there first though. Long, long trek. Here's, no, not this. Oh wait, I thought I had, wait, what is shield grease? Oh, boost guarding ability, okay. Hmm. Okay, before we start this attempt, I need to hop up for a sec, so I'll be right back. This is probably a great place to stop. BRB. Okay, I'm back. I haven't actually used the dragon grease yet. It says it grants you special gra dragon attacks. Dragon. I don't really know what that means. Granting anti-dragon effects. Okay, maybe not what it sounds like. This is just made from mixing gravel. what I was thinking. Blood grease. I'm not sure if this can coat an already elemented armament. But, um, I'm curious. I'm ready to find out. Ah, 
you can't. That's so sad. I do that instead of drinking a potion, instead of trinking. Fourth time? No. Okay. I just stopped being greedy. <laughs> I just stopped greeting. That's all it takes, I guess. Let's pop this, whatever. Let's make my life even easier. A kindness to myself, a reward. Okay, this guy. Primarily using the single whip hits because I want to preserve my uh, stem. If you're wondering. <laughs> okay. All right, the miracle can happen. just have to 
finish off this last one. I have anything yummy that could help me. What's gravity do? <laughs> I probably shouldn't. It scales with int, so I'm not going to worry about that. Okay. I need to just take that time to just do a normal whip attack on them. Sip. Oh, I don't have any. Okay. How do you, what do you think? Good? Yes. You want to know what? I did not know I was heading here. However, this is the charm I was talking about earlier that I wanted and figured I would probably never unequip after getting it. Vastly raises equip load. Pops me up from 65.6 .6 to 78.1, which is pretty good. <laughs> so now I can use heavy anything I find. Um... I also read that I think it might be a percentage of your equip load. It's not like a flat amount, which would explain why it increased it by such a weird number. So I'm not positive of that, but kick. I think Havel's ring was like a flat amount in Dark Souls 1, wasn't it? Was it not flat? I wonder if you can get in there. Oh, it was plus 50%. Ah, that makes sense. This is like, I think, plus 20% or something. Probably in order to avoid Havel's Ring being, or at least feeling, uh, required. <laughs> Uh, I've seen inside these jars, and I would not say it's cool in there. I think it's, uh, gross. Alright, I've been streaming for six hours. Um, I should probably stop. 
but before I do... God, I didn't really accomplish as much as I thought I would today. Uh, before I stop, I will show you the boss of Kaelid. So if you don't want to see that, um, be warned, I guess. So this actually took me by surprise. I didn't know this area was going to be open. I came here to test a weapon that I had gotten because usually there's like a bunch of guys out here and I usually just slap them in the back, use them as a training dummy for testing out different things. Um, but I got here and everybody's gone. There's chanting. And then over here, this area, which normally has a boss fog door, did not have a fog door. It's open, I can walk in. Um, and then there's this guy from the loading screen is here. And this lady is here, who taught me how to polite bow, I think. Um, this guy's gonna yell at me again, I guess. My friend the warrior jar is here. No, I'd never met the dog before. The only one I these clowns that I've met before is um Alexander. And I summoned this guy for a boss fight once. I don't know who this is. <laughs> Grab that great rune. When I saw this guy, um Kano said that uh, you know he ate a pizza, because it looks like he bit a whole pizza, and it's in his mouth right now, and the, there's a pizza shaped wide on his head. I think that's that's a good take on it. Do I need to, like, talk to the guy again every time I come back here? Ah, okay. This guy's also on the loading screen. Are you good and prepared, young chum? The festival! Ready as I'll ever be. Skip. But now. Anyway, I am not going to beat this guy. Because I have not <laughs> I've not powered up at all since last time I tried this. But I do want to show you. Whoa. So that over there is... Um, the boss arena. And we're going to go in. I'm going to waste my rune arc by showing you this. So there's the boss. <laughs> and here's a lot of summon signs of all the guys that were in that courtyard. And you just summon them and send them running in. All the warriors are here. Oh fuck, I hate when he does this. Stop, stop, okay. I love to see Alexander the warrior jar <laughs> trundle on in. Anyway, I have no fucking idea how to beat this guy. He's really cool. He's riding a horse that's way too small for him. Oh, actually, my face stuff might be good at getting him.
Everybody is dead now, though. <laughs> I don't know what this move even is. Oh, we got lightning. Oh! <laughs> Wait, is that gravity? Maybe? I've never made it this far. Maybe I will beat him. Patches? <laughs> Wait, what the fuck was that? <laughs> Alright, wait a sec. Wait a sec. Maybe I'll make another attempt at this. <laughs> I didn't know there was going to be a second round of guys. They don't actually reappear after they die. Whoops, what am I doing? Uh, because the last time I tried this, I let everybody die and then just ran around the entire area. No, they literally don't. Listen to me. <laughs> I ran around the entire area and they did not reappear. So you have to actually be making progress on the boss, I think. If you just run away the whole time, they will not. You're free to start a new game and try it yourself, I guess, if you don't believe me. Do the thing. Okay, here we go. There's one back. Okay, well then there is some kind of, uh, some kind of, uh, yeah, what am I trying to say? Some kind of circumstance wherein they do not respawn. Because <laughs> like I said, I literally spent the entire, uh, I like sent all the guys and then ran away the entire time and nobody respawned. So I think you do have to at least be like engaging a little bit maybe. If they do respawn though, that makes this a lot easier. I don't think it needs a phase change because some of them are respawning up here now. I don't really know what the deal is. Uh-oh. My horse! Oh, jeez. I wonder if he can jump that.
A finger maiden was here? <laughs> up at the sky oh I see where the fuck is patches I need patches now Funny. Why did he even put his <laughs> summon sign down? Oh, don't do that. I think it's possible, but definitely annoying. I'm constantly thinking that about Dark Soul. That it seems impossible if you only have melee options. But people manage to play that way, so... Mostly just requires being way more careful about learning attack patterns and stuff. Wait, who is that? Thank you, Patches. It would be funny if it was doing that much because it's a god slayer. But I don't know if that's what it is. I think it's just strong. There's all my guys. I don't know why I had iframes on that first one. Oh, there's one. Alexander! Okay. <laughs> I love seeing all of them roll.
I'm actually gonna equip this. I love this guy's too small horse. Hey, what are you doing? Stop chasing me. I'm normal. God, the way those just are barely dodgeable. It's so scary. Did I knock him over? Oh, oh. <laughs> okay, you can jump that. Okay. Bring everybody in for one... One big party. Come from that way. God, it's so funny looking. Hey, there's an item out here. Put on spear. What is that? I think I found that each time I've come in here. Is that like a like a one use item? God. I don't have time to fucking like inspect it. It's an arrow type. A great arrow. Ah, I see. Leave me be. Oh. <laughs> All right, those. <laughs> Yeah, I feel like there's probably nothing you can do to stop those from hitting you if you're on a horse. Feels dangerous. Sometimes the coward's way is delay. So sad whenever Lion and Lol dies. Oh, 
Oh fuck. Oh fuck. This is not going as well. That's a nice thing you can do with those. Get them stuck in the, the hill. Accuracy is shit this fight. <laughs> Ow. Targeting. someone. Get in there. Okay, his purple rocks are gone. What is he doing? so greedy for that. It is a Psycho Crusher, actually. You're right. Ooh, I want to beat him. Ooh. I could probably stand to... I don't think it's going to be a difference maker, but I keep forgetting that I need to upgrade my... Um, my God Slayer seal. Because it's currently like plus two or something.
I wonder if it's actually worth using Fireball over Lightning Spear. I'm going to try Lightning Spear and see how much damage it does. Because the accuracy on this is way higher. Okay, I should just be using this. <laughs> the way he stomps the horse into the ground is so good. with Lightning Spear is I keep thinking I'm in range and then I'm not. He's so huge it's actually really hard to tell. Come on, Patches. That's the best part of the Souls games, is that they're all a little bit goofy. They're kind of like Monster Hunter in that way. Except not as, not quite as outward about it, but I feel like Souls protagonists and Monster Hunter heroes, heroes? Monster Hunters are cut from the same cloth. Monster Hunter champions. Tunes from Monster Hunter. You know them. Point, I should be using a shield. Ouch. Almost ouch. A near ouch. Okay. I wish they would put a limit on these blade works, personally. Unregulated blade works. Except for the healer. LB3. Oh. Why did it just show me Alexander for a second? <laughs> Visions of Alexander.
to be close enough. <laughs> Come on! It's like a full FP bar wasted. Didn't even scream. Oh, God, I wish. I wish my uh, my shit was a little more accurate. <laughs> this, there's no way this is gonna be good, but. Oh wait, I just made arrows. Fuck. Those aren't bolts. Okay, well. I'll get 12 shots in with this thing. Oh, I'm gonna be heavy. <laughs> That's fine! It probably would be worth that, but I don't think uh, that's going to be a difference maker overall. Oh, shit. I'm fine. Dodging has high frames, yeah. It has hella high frames. Uh, can you not shoot? <laughs> I see. <laughs> Alright, I guess it would be fucked up if you could shoot a great crossbow on a horse. He got so mad that I even tried this. <laughs> Could try my longbow. What does a dwelling arrow do? Deals magic damage. I'll just spend all my cool arrows now. <laughs> the weapons like blocking the arrow actually threw me off and scared me. <laughs> I do wish there was, like, one rifle in this game. Kind of like how there's one really shitty shield in Bloodborne. Well, maybe there's more, I don't know. But there's only one that I know about. Let's put, like, one really shitty gun in this one. Great start. Bye. I have to be smart at all.
think switching things up is making me worse, but that's okay. My least favorite favorite part of this fight, even though it feels cool the first few times you do it, is having to do this initial run up. Every single time. Like, it doesn't get any less sick. It's just, I don't want to have to do it every time. <laughs> Sixty-two. Okay, let's save that for when it's difficult to get to him otherwise. I'm being patted on the back. I think I might be being encouraged to stop soon. <laughs> Dude, it's 5.13 p.m. She's patting me now. I think I may have hit the <laughs> She's patting me slightly more aggressively. <laughs> I may be hitting the nail on the head. I have headphones in, I can't hear. It's patting me nicely on the head now. Kind. <laughs> Maybe I'm getting burped? Maybe. into all those guys I just summoned. Uh-oh. Nope. Funny stones. I had to do was live. I'll stop seeing. <laughs> Before too long. She's holding up one finger. <laughs> I have to make this one count, I guess.
Getting some good angles on him this time. Well, where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Okay, well, never found him, but it didn't matter. Coward. While also making sure that he has targets. are gone. Fuck. No, 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 no. Okay, we're fine. Quote unquote. Oh, I don't know what this move is. <laughs> Rocks. Oh, please don't fucking. No, 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 no. Why did I gonna get off my horse? <laughs> horse, stay active, please. Where is he? Oh, that's his rocks. Uh oh. I die in this one, I hope that it's nowhere close to winning so that I don't feel the pull of one more.
I'm gonna... Wait a minute, one of my whips has no... <laughs> no enchantment on it! How long has that been true? Ah, oh, jeez. Thank you, Bolt, for five coin. And some kind of message, probably. Is everybody dead? Uh oh. horse. Killed by the yes no prompt. Well, okay. All right. Well, thanks everyone. <laughs> we didn't kill this guy. I guess I might just need to be more powerful before I try this. Okay. I'll see y'all tomorrow for probably more of this. Um, I have non Elden Ring plans for Friday and Saturday, so uh, I'll let people know How about that soon. Bye. Have good evenings, all of you. Thank you, Ashley, for three coins.